live. We're live, folks. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I see a few of you uh, rejects One in chat. Thank you, thank you, thank you for dropping by. I think. Uh, Celtic Boar 13 in chat. Yep, there we go. We Celtic Boar. Bow before you. We bow before <laughs> you humbly. This introduction. So, nice. yes, who's coming on nice. is going to be part of the charity stream game that we're running uh, for Lord Gasumba, who Kirsten just left his channel. I think they're wrapping up or finishing up. We might see them come over here and harass us, or he'll, who knows who else is streaming. He'll write in, but we hope everybody's doing well. Still trying to get rid of the congestion and all that from the lovely flu that I've been carting around here for a couple of weeks. Um, but we're here. We're ready to play a little D&D &D tonight. Might be a little bit sh uh, shorter show again, uh, just for being sick and uh, Sorrow's feeling bad too, so she didn't... Dear. She humbly asked if we didn't put her on camera tonight, so that's why you see her picture. But she's here. I am um, here. Yay. So, yes. So, Disembodied voice. Yes, exactly. So, well, there's some of those where they have uh, some of the streams where they have the avatar actually chats and talks and all that, uh, you know. Yeah, the, the VTuber. Is, yeah. Oh, that's so, fun. That's what it's called. Yeah, putting that on y'all sometimes, you know, and just, you know. Oh, that, I mean, that happened. We just do that when we, we're not feeling cute to be on camera. I'm just going to pull a character up. She'll represent everything I do. Throw a table at everybody. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah. So, ho, folks, lay out. So, yeah, we're here playing tonight. We've got plenty of stuff going on. Uh, an intermission will run tonight. Make sure you check our schedule out. Uh, we got plenty of shows happening. Uh, there'll be a couple of changes uh, that are taking place here, show wise. That it will be. Uh, we'll make some announcements uh, off our lovely social media feeds. Who Kirsten Vixera here manages for us. Um, so that's happening. Yay. We've got, like I said, the charity stream coming up in two weeks here for St. Jude's, the Greyhawk charity stream uh, sponsored and run by Lord Gasumba, Mr. J. Scott. Uh, we're running our show Friday uh, after, or I guess noon to four Eastern time uh, on Friday the 18th. 18th. Thank you. Whoops. Hopefully he's not here yet. So he did not get upset with me for getting. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so we're running that. Uh, then I believe uh, uh, Troll Lord Games, Stephen Chenault takes over and then passes it on to uh, Carlos Slicing uh, for the Friday show. I'm not, I don't remember the Saturday lineup, but we have a banner, so we'll show you. Um, and then uh, in March, we've got Gary Con that'll be going on, which I'll be out at running the channel from out there uh, and some live stuff with interviews and helping uh, Mr. Edkison run his actor Roki out there. And while that's going on, this channel will be taken over by the Mech 45, Josh and gang to run uh, a 24 hour mega stream of games or gamers for giving that we have done the last couple of years. Thanks to him now being a part of the channel. So it's his baby. We run it uh, and try to raise money for the lovely game carts that they take and put into hospitals that have a PlayStation or an Xbox on them with the TV it's and so the kids, cool. yeah, the kids can sit in their beds and, you know, try to relax and, not worry about what's happening with them and play some video games. So it's kind of cool. We got to raise enough money last year for a cart. We're going to try to do that again this year. Um, but unfortunately, it was the same day, same weekend that I'm out at uh, Lake Geneva. So um, I will not be able to participate, but I'll hang out and check in from time to time. Um, so other than that, let's start. Let's go to introductions and kind of a recap and a rehash of kind of what's been happening and a few things that are going to be going on here with this show uh, over the next month or so. But uh, let's start off with Izra. Tell us everything about yourself and you know the drill. Just do it. You know. Hold on, I gotta put emotes in chat. We're doing emotes. Ha! There you go. Hi guys, I'm Francis and I go by Fort Worth Bell here on Twitch and over on Twitter. You can also find me on Etsy under Southern Studio Home. I play Isra Gray. She is an ASMR paladin and the mama bear of the group. And she is currently like numb from the loss of Janna and trying to like keep that all boxed up so that she does not lose her shit before we can get these slaves to safety. What's up, Josh? That is for me. Aslani. Hey, I am Lori. I play Maslani, our uh, wonderful little rogue who is now dual classing as a bard, so I have vicious mockery. Yay! I can't wait to use that. Um, and y'all can watch me struggle and figure out how to 
do a spell on a computer because computers, yay. Um, anyway, I'm a tattoo artist uh, in Golden, Colorado. Uh, you could come see me there. Um, let's see what else. Uh, I have a barking dog. Sorry. Um, so yes, you could see me at uh, Faith Tattoo in Golden, Colorado. And let's see what else. Oh, I run a group called 37 Zombies. We have 20-ish game masters that run wonderful events for your entertainment, usually at Gen Con. Uh, and it sounds as though we are making our appearance there in person this year. So we are super duper happy about that. Uh, and that's me. There you go. Sorrow. Hey, guys. This is Cherry Fate. Thanks, Sorrow. The young David <coughs> Tiefling, uh who is oh gosh I, I don't know I'm also a variety streamer on Twitch occasionally but y'all can follow me on Twitter at Furied Fate and I'll announce when I actually do go live and what else I'm doing and what else is going on in my life uh, like home renovations at the moment but uh, yeah Sorrow's here with the girls <clears throat> she wants to find her friend Tim and hopefully uh, we actually get to find him or she is going to throw a fit I keep thinking Tim's a she so. it's a, Sorrow it doesn't know gender she's like they. whatever it should be a they're they, a they. Yes. it's going to be a they that's right there you go alright Vixera hey guys I am Kirsten I play the high elf cleric Vixera or Vix Vix Vapor Rub uh, I'm an artist. You can find me on Twitter, usually at Myriad underscore is my social media at Myriad X underscore X. It's been a long day. <laughs> is my social media <laughs> handle for all social media platforms. Uh, I am the social media manager for Praetor's Reject. So if you see some posts going out all the time, that's me. Uh, and yeah, Vix is just, she's, she's sad Jana's not here anymore, but she's not going to show it. <laughs> She's gonna hold it deep inside of her and then she's gonna die <laughs> yes for everybody's asking you know, the, the black curtain that you see on the overlay is uh for their lost companion Jana, who uh was played by emily square malix uh who had to uh she's just real popular now uh and mm -hmm. shares the success that she's been having on her twitch channel she unfortunately had to step away from our campaign so uh they are mourning her loss uh, in their battle uh, in the underground slaver complex where Jano just was basically oofed away in a dimension Oof. door by an evil elf woman. And they are in mourning about that. But we will be on the lookout and put together another post where we're going to find a replacement player for uh, the ladies here uh, to join back in uh, hopefully soon. Got to start working on it. Um, but... The show last week. Um, who wants to recap? Don't all jump at once. We kind of, we kind of got our <laughs> I wasn't here. Almost kicked, right? Yeah. We left. We left Moss in a safe place, and then we ended up meeting Moss, and we almost had a really bad time. <laughs> well, well, Moss was babysitting the slaves. Let, let's let's give her some credit. She was babysitting yeah, the she slaves. Was, she was babysitting the slaves, and then we went while we were we taking care of the undead. We were adventure more, and we stumbled upon a lot of half orcs, and it was a bad time. Uh, and that. then we uh, we retreated very gracefully. <laughs> well, we did take out a strong force. It was strategic. The, strategic. Of the orcs. You did yeah. take out a couple. Yes, you did. Um, yeah. And then we, we made it out of the compound and we're mm -hmm. headed headed towards uh, the, the hideout that uh, Brother Makaro has. Right. Mm -hmm. And y'all got a, across one of the major roads or headed to, uh, uh, you, you had a, got it's a quick downtime or, you know, a quick rest in one of the houses, uh, ruined, ruined, you know, areas that y'all were able to, when y'all were scoping out the slaver compound. Then continue on, and then ran into zombies uh, in one of the another you know, ruined areas of Highport. A lot of this uh, town, which was what a thriving city and all that, is basically just destroyed and ruined from an orc invasion a long time ago. Most of it has not been rebuilt. Um, and that it, where we left off. I think you're all were at the Purple Square, um, and you got in tow of about twenty slaves. Uh, that they've rescued, plus their favorite, uh, you know, sugar fiend, 
uh, boy who talks to him all the time. He's still alive. He is still alive. You did not push him into the flowing sewer underground. Still kicking. Okay. I thought right. I thought we left him out for like zombie bait, and he got turned, and we had to kill him, smite him. Or I, something. I I was just not I I was just not letting anybody else die. It's not happening. Mm -hmm. I can hey, make no him eat some died. more candy if you want. Okay, so <laughs> he has okay. no more candy. candy. <laughs> no more candy, candy in the bag. Coming from right, and is it mm -hmm. even candy at this bunch, point? He's gotten hold of a, a wine now. Oh we... no, that's not good sailed with the with the dwarf that first city that we were in i bought a whole bunch of candy but it's gone now <laughs> see it's gone now though uh -huh. we hope <laughs> it's gone you never know it could show back up okay there's uh, always candy a... oh god everyone gets a thank you i was just about to mention that Are gets, we all... yeah, everybody so gets what now Point of inspo. Josh, uh, Josh. Yeah, Zarathon yeah. cheered the 1500, so everyone's going to get a point of inspo, and then I'm going to tuck away two, two potions of healing, and then we're going to have an extra yes. 100 for an inspo in case anyone needs it this session. I see that. I see that. Beautiful. Inspo in our own game, I just wanted folks. To, uh, to contribute to the hype train. It's hyping. Right. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, so, yeah, that's uh, what's happening here. Uh, they have laid waste pretty much to. Um, the slaver compound here. However, they can't, don't forget though, however, that man got away. Man got away. Who's this Dirk? Dirk, Dirk is what y'all know him by. Dirt. But you have some papers Dirt. that you need to review that I think we well, kind of went over, but there was another name mentioned there. Yeah. So, I Sturm. Sturm. Buckholes. He looks like a sturm. Sturm. All right. Anyway, so that's where we're going to pick up the action. We're probably going to be running just half a show tonight, uh, everyone. Um, we are going to, what's going to happen here um, is uh, they're going to go into some downtime. Once they get back over to Macaro, they've got plenty of things to determine and plan and think about what's up. Um, for those who are new to the show and all that, because... Uh, Finding out, yeah, we've been playing over a year now, this uh, game so far. Um, and um, three of the ladies here, that would be Isra, Maslani, and Vixera, are not from this world. They've come over here from the Sword Coast, the from a dimensional door. They were brought over. Sorrow's character is from this area. Uh, and they met up inside Highport because Sorrow is, is, like I said, looking for... Her friend, him, him, uh, and she is a yes, a young childish um, child, uh, tiefling. Um, but by anyway, wolves, literally. Uh, <sighs> so, um, but they, uh, they are girl. The 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 main group raid. We, we got, got raid. Is, is it raid? I see view. Yeah. Oh, I see raid. Hey, lawful stupid. Wow. Thank y'all for the raid. Welcome to the rejects. The stupids or lawful stupids. Um, I, I kind of love that. Like, yep. is that, I need that to be a, uh, yep. um, thank you. Whatever that's okay. called. Lawful evil. Yep. What are those called again? We, <laughs> My brain. Alignments? We call ourselves the rejects. <laughs> we have, oh, we are very words. far from any really good gameplay. Okay. So just welcome. Okay. Mistakes are abound on this channel, mostly by me. Um, yes, thank you for the raids, the biddies, all the going on. We got content. We we'll, gifted the subs. Someone yeah, anonymously I, gifted some subs. I saw that. Awesome, anonymous. Thank you very much for the tier one subs to the people. Uh, we run games here on the channel, either here on Twitch or on YouTube. One, two, three, four, six nights a week. So. Um, fr on, fr on Wednesdays and Friday nights, we have games over on YouTube channel. Uh, the rest of the nights are over here on Twitch, uh, for the moment, uh, there'll be some changes to that. And we're dark on Sundays at the moment, but it looks like Seth is going to start running when he's running his magic show on his coven MTG channel. He's just going to co-stream over here on our channel also. Um, but thank y'all very much for coming over and hanging out. So back to the game, uh, they got on the map. Y'all are at the purple circle. 
and you have got 20 slaves with you that you are pulling, you know, getting to, like I said, Brother Macaro, who is over here on the map at where the number one is at. Um, Slash and four. You have our floor right above, yeah, right below the four area. Um, didn't he? No, oh, can't even Just see it on the, the sus There it is. Road. Yeah, on the sus road. That's right. Um, so. Was that really the name of it, or did we decide that? Oh, no, it's no, called Sus. Yeah. Yeah. Really it, it, yeah. yeah, it literally says, "Oh, that's funny." Sus. Okay, so what are we doing? You got, you got, you were moving into some ruins, and that's when the zombies hit you. So. We, we took them out. We you took them out. out. Yes, you did. Uh, we're gonna try to move our little herd to where nine is on the map. The, the printed nine, not the. Okay. You got a major road there that is uh -huh. uh, to cross that you uh, understanding those in this area where y'all are at is mostly run by the orcs. There are a few humanoid camp compounds uh, and a but human the district area. the controls on the roads aren't constant, right? Like we can uh, kind of stake it out or we've had enough time to stake it out. <laughs> you, you're able to watch. Scheduled. You're able to watch. Yeah. The main road that you've got that comes from the north town and out the southern gate um that is completely um that is the gates are guarded by a large contingent of orcs and um you know that the slave caravans um and the supply deals have gone out that south gate that's why it's called slave road I figure um what time of yeah, day is it where go are we, where are we this at this way yeah, so making your way across the road, you're going to have to scope that out. Who's going to go do, as you move through the ruin areas there, because it's kind of open or dilapidated buildings, most of it's rubble. Um, who's going to go check out the road and try to plan what they see? Uh, I can do that. Let's can you say, do that, really? I, I, I am not <laughs> stealthy. Isra is the yeah, wrong let's... person. Clink, 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 oh. clink, clink, your armor. Yeah. Clink. <laughs> with my shit armor, with my acid damaged armor. We're going to get you new yeah. armor, I swear. <laughs> We're going to get you new armor, um, don't worry. What kind of like wa local wildlife is in this area? Like, you know, possums, rats, mice, dogs, Oh, I'm cats. sure you can find, I'm sure, well... That's a good question. Uh, there are, you know, rats from time to time. You know, however, you know, there are varmints everywhere. There's no doubt about that. Um, so I would say you find that, but you also know that there's plenty of things that move around at night or could be possibly happening that eat that also. Okay. So I would like to turn into a local varmint that is a little bit bigger than a rat that's less likely to get eaten. Okay. A weasel. Careful. Duff likes to kill a animals. Weasel. Man, sure she's I, going right up me. Oh, man. With that. Awesome Farm stuff. Farm less likely to get murdered. But you, not, you know, but not this suspicious. This is a tough game. I love this. <laughs> That's why I'm asking for my options, man. You got to well, the, There's always Ooh, options. You should be a raccoon. Could you be a raccoon? <gasps> I can be a raccoon. Oh, we can finally give Iser the pet she wanted. It's just another party member, though. <laughs> <laughs> but I can be a raccoon for eight hours. Okay, wait. Uh -huh. Iser needs to roll to see if she can restrain herself from not just cuddling the raccoon to death. Let's see. Like, what's that going to be? Tiny That's pink be... raccoon. Would there be a willpower check or something? I like want a, to like be a like wisdom? a very vicious raccoon that like hisses at people. That'd be crazy. So you're just foaming at the mouth. I'm exactly. I'm rolling exactly. It. exactly. I'll be that type of raccoon. 26. Uh, I, I okay. restrains herself. All right. So <laughs> she knows it's a bad well, idea to cuddle a raccoon. Well, me. I Let am me a see song. here. Mark one count. Um, all right. Did you, did you say what time of day it was? I'm sorry. I got uh, lost in raccoon land. I think that, well, ladies, what did we, um, We did a y'all did a y'all did do a rest, time. right? So or we not. Did. We crossed, sure we, we did. To, we totally did. Yeah, we crossed to uh what was it? Area ten when it was daytime and then we rested. Okay. Then you've got zombies. But y'all do have damage. 
So that means. Yeah. So we haven't rested after the zombies. Yeah, that's what it is. I thought okay. we ran into the zombies while we were like mid going through the ruins and. You were uh, y'all were traveling uh, through nine. them when they came out. Yes, yes. Okay. So, the, so I want to say that someone make me roll. Even it's day odd. It's night. Early it's night time. Night. Early night time. Okay. Now, uh, so sorrow, um. You uh, change into a a um, rat figure. Trash panda. Yeah, trash, <laughs> trash panda. panda. There you go, trash panda, um, whose mask is off a little kilter. Um, and you are doing what? Uh, so she's going to make her way to the bushes slash hedge line that is closest to the road uh, to kind of observe the orcs and their patrols. So, you will move to the road or south of the road. We'll just kind of, you know, put you, you know, just not too far from where y'all are, you know, recovering from the zombie attack um, and hanging, you know, and keeping everybody safe. Uh, and yeah, what you'll see on this road, um, you'll contingent or two, maybe. Um, then, you know, kind of sparse, they come off, they come out of the 1819 area, which, you know, is one of the main checkpoints of traffic that comes out of the populated area of the Southern part or the North, North, sorry, Northern part of high port along the waterfront and all that. Uh, and this group you know, groups go that way. It looks like their supplies or man, you know, just kind of doing lollygag patrolling. Um, though they don't, they're not lollygagging though. They're definitely, Remember uh, what we discussed is when y'all came out, um, smoke still filled the air. There was still, you know, a pall that you could kind of feel over what was happening because of Viva la Revolution had ravaged through Highport. Okay, and the goblins, you know, apparently got riled up by some force unknown to throw off the shackles. <laughs> yeah, throw off their shackles of the orc. <laughs> so and uh one maslani yeah exactly uh and so but remember then when you as that was going on uh a new group of orcs um wearing different and a lot more of the yellow sashes and all that came um, coming in from the south gate area uh starting to overtake and put order take out the chaos and put order back into high port because this is okay. definitely a orc run metropolis so but there's some traffic back and forth very little in the way of other humanoid types you know goblins maybe a few scurry about definitely see them you know give way when an orc contingent comes through uh there are a couple of caravans or supplies that maybe that come down the road and they head toward the walled off section of seven which is the uh southwestern area which uh in uh common sense known would have been what was considered like a more royal part of the city at one time but is you know um not as much now but y'all never went in there so you, d you have no idea actually what's happening there but you can definitely watch the road for a little while uh being it early evening uh You'll see torches start going up, lights and bonfires kind of being set off uh, to light up certain areas of the town um, that you know are not in the that are being have been rebuilt to some degree. Um, you'll know also remember that they light the bonfires because they have been dealing with um, these sturge invasions that had happened, yes. you know, a while yes, back ago. That. We haven't seen one in a while. But you know, y'all were subjected because we've to been it. like inside and underground for a while. So. Right, we've been indoors. Is it? Does yes. it seem that? Well, and didn't we, we take out that big, big old? Boy. Yeah. Okay, well, well, two people are saying the something. Lord, where we okay. took out the big one and it. Well, took out the rest. so well, yeah. So y'all, but yeah. So y'all met you, you, in the back part of the temple area on the first floor when y'all went into that back room behind where you took out the female cleric. Um, that was doing stuff or looked like she was getting ready to do some stuff with some slaves. 
you find a room that had some zombies in it that were not they they had these big yeah, puncture wounds in their chest and you wreck you knew yeah you know, y'all found that they looked very similar to what sturges do but there was this huge abomination type sturge looking creature that was roosting there and y'all took it out after you know the sorrow darkness spell you know that put Jana. <laughs> In harm's way. Whatever, it saved her life for like a couple of turns. I remember that. Yeah, she, and uh, yeah, so yeah, um, y'all don't know. I told you what the purpose of it was because the actual the creature that we I used for that actually came out of the new add on to Curse of Strahd. It was one of the new monsters nice. that came out of there. Yeah. It's a new it's a new version of a Master Sturge or something like that. And you just so really anyway, wanted to show it off. Yeah, I was showing it off. So, but yeah. So do we? So as it like goes to nighttime, do we notice like a a decrease in activity like along the road and stuff? Yes, yes. That's what my point was. Right, is that, that would is be definitely easy. that would be easy for us to cross. Yes, them. yes. Yep. Do do I hear anything coming out of the orcs that I that is of any use other than them just being orcs and doing their thing? They're being just orcs. Yeah, and um that no information uh, not no. yet is nothing is concerned as far as what has happened inside the compound uh, other than that it's they've they've put down goblin usurpers and you know put right back uh the orc king or commander you know uh is apparently going to be making a visit in here sometime though we don't know when um but you know um the main thing was to get this get Highport back under control so they could get commerce coming back in here. The one thing that they've done quite, you know, differently than normal orcs would do is that there has been some structure brought to Highport, um, even though it is definitely on the dark or evil side, but there is still commerce that runs through here and definitely trade ships that come in and out to sell wares or do things, you know, um, because y'all are unremembering, you know, the Pomars that's here in this area that's to uh, the west is definitely an evil, you know, overrun area of all the baddies. So, thanks for the follow. And Lomas Lifa, yeah, we know that uh, Gamers Forgiving, unfortunately, is while Gary Khan's going on, but unfortunately, nothing we can do about it. Um, that's when they decided to run their part, their commit, their weekend of. Yeah, it's a it's a larger charity. We're charity. not. We're, we didn't have the dates. Yeah not something we we can control um it is a bit usually they have a big land party that they run uh and they stream the games out of there of all the hundreds of computers and the people that are streaming we're just one of the groups that does the virtual side but we're still going to be running the, um, the charity event while i'm at gary con so um so but yeah so you can you can you recon successfully understanding of what's going on, on the road sorrow Okay, yeah. So as soon as I do, um, you know, get a good sense of it, come back in my little um, trash panda self, and uh, panda. turn back, turn back to to normal sorrow self, to be like, hey, that's what I saw. I mean, unless like, I mean, cuddle you for a minute, like just to make her happy, because that's going to make it really hard for me to convey what's going on. Can um, unless somebody can talk cuddles? to you to trash panda self. And I, I don't know how ambidextrous I am or... to like, to, no, not really. Um, I mean, I talk as an I animal. I will cast Speak, speak with, with Animals. animals. Oh, this God. is the first time I've ever cast this spell. Okay. Does it work sure. if it's a magical yeah. animal? Uh -huh. she's, yeah. She's still an animal. I'm still an That's animal. That's true. All right. So I'm doing my squeak, squeak, squeakers to, to Isra. Oh, we want to hear it. I we got to RP it. I... Oh, okay. So, squeak, 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 and squeak, 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 <laughs> squeak, squeak, squeak. Can, can you make She's me so a, a insight check on that, Maslani, to see if you understand it? Isra. <laughs> Isra. Sorry, Isra's doing Isra? it. Sorry, Isra. Sorry, Isra. You want to make that insight check at adv at, with advantage, sure. please? Only here on the rejects, sure. folks. Okay. I want to cuddle the raccoon. Right. Oh, well, yeah, look you at that. You can hold me if it helps. Okay. I guess you understand enough of the squeak squeaking. 
could she be considered an emotional support animal and we can get <laughs> oh bonuses God. for that? <laughs> only Just for saying. eight hours, okay? I'm only I'm only I mean, eight hey, hours. It's a bonus. Only for eight hours or until I Sorrow gets tired and decides she's gonna close <laughs> her eyes out. <laughs> I mean, if I just gonna carry me around, that's cool. That means I don't have to walk. Isra stands, relays the information about the orc tr uh, patrols to uh, Moss and Vix. It's like, um, Sorrow, you you can hang out with me, and like I'm just like like massaging your head, giving you like Scratch little back ear. scratches. Does her little foot wiggle when you scratch her? I don't know. Sorry, it's <laughs> rolling. Uh, That's me doing I, something. I don't think so. At least, at least not that she's aware of. Okay. Sorrow, if at any time you don't want me to pet you, just let me know. Oh, you'll be bitten. It's fine. Okay. I'm Can they give out rabies? Price? You know, like 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 cats. Well, no, that's a myth. Not all raccoons give rabies. But I was just asking as an attack. Like, could you transform oh. into an animal with rabies and then attack? Well, no, because that would be transforming into an animal with disease. I'm not a diseased animal. Debatable. What kind of person do you think of. I am? <laughs> I mean, Debatable. unless when you're transformed, you get bit by an animal that has rabies, then I could very transform into an animal that has some venom. Oh, that would work. Or, anyway, or if they're if they're if they're I, allergic I see to the like wheels in hedgehogs. Moss's brain like turning. Oh, like, this is, <laughs> let's not go down that road, please. Because like I, I was, I found out I was allergic to hedgehogs because my brother had a hedgehog and I was holding it, and then every time I held it, I got a rash. Okay, that's rolling. That's rolling. We need to. Do <laughs> oh, that's rolling. That's not good. Uh, uh, ba based on the the reconnaissance, reconnaissance. Oh my god. Recon. Somebody else say the there word. We go. Recon. Thank Recon. you. Info Duff, we 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 attempt to sneak past this road in between patrols. Okay, give me some uh, stealth rolls, I'm gonna please. Cast, I'm going to preemptively cast enhance ability on on Ice Rock. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> and I'm going to boot oh, myself. Boy. Stealth. Where's my stealth? Biggest of boosts. Commoners are not very stealthy. Your slaves are uh, not very commoners. Oh, <gasps> damn it. We didn't think about that. Thank them. you, Vix. Can, wait, wait. Can we give uh, our, our extra inspo to uh, one of the commoners that did poorly? <laughs> yeah, I rolled a, yeah. Uh, three dice and they were they were under. The average was under. Well, what was the average, that, actually? Uh, I'm sorry. What was the average? It was 9, um, 5, and 19. So that's. What's that? It's nine, five, 14, us. and 20. It's 33 divided by three and 11. Oh, wow. Just barely averaged over 10. Oh, okay. So cool. you're I fine. I got a 10. Man. Okay. Yeah, 10 is what <laughs> you had to have. <laughs> you hope. So uh, you can make your way across the street. Make your way across the main road there into nine, which definitely you will see before you... Um, some ruins, but so if you standing houses or some stuff that was trying to be rebuilt, um, and you will see that's where is it? Come here, I'm gonna come in. Wait, it mask. All right, back to this. All righty. And the commoners. Bottom right corner. What, you are, what is that? It's a house. Oh, um, okay. Okay. And you're going to see um, the roads. You can see kind of, you know, roads going off the side. You have got another is house or... yeah it's it's run down we're just using it for um gameplay purposes and all that but it's a ruined house okay, okay. can we uh thanks lawful good seeing you 
and I make our way the inn and kind of like take a look around. In the house that's there? Yeah, just to mm-hmm. make sure there's mm-hmm. nothing cr- yeah, broken it, out. No, there's nothing. Yeah, you could look in. It's, you know, most of it's gutted inside. Most of the roof where it's kind of black like that is kind of where it's been fire burned and missing, you know, sagging in, you know. Do, um, I know there have been a lot of places where people have been hiding and whatnot. Can I do some kind of perception check and see if there isn't any, like, trapdoor type things in the floor? Or, you know what I mean? Like, uh, hidden doors or anything like hiding that? Hiding holes. Mm-hmm. The, like hiding spots or anything or does it seem like completely it's, vacant and no one it's just an old yeah right? no this says there's nothing here yeah yeah okay yeah it's just a ruined building but you know How you've got to get to through the- this area to the other side to okay. continue on so we will so let's sneak do you guys want to sneak in between the, the two left or do you want to sneak up uh, I think, uh, so north? Yeah, so we would go, like, this way? Or sure. do you want to go between the two buildings? So we have more Are cover? there, Duff, are there, like, are there buildings that obviously aren't on the map to, like, the, yeah, the you, right of? You can okay. see there's more, yeah, you're seeing more. Just when y'all came in from this angle, you were, the house was, y'all came in at that angle, so you're kind of blocked. But can you move around and look some more? Sure. Sure. And you'll see that, you know, your block your way's blocked somewhat going north. Okay. We'll go this way. Being very careful and stealthy. Particularly particularly uh paying attention to any sort of flapping noises that may arise from the sky. <laughs> yeah. What? Yeah. yeah. What flapping noise is. I'm gonna take a look and see what's around here. Do you need to unlock the tokens, or are they just... No, I'm here? gonna be moving them in a second, and I'm looking at something I've oh. got. Okay. Um, just a quick question, Duff. What, what what are the stats for a raccoon? Probably comparable to a cat. Probably. Let's see. I mean... They all I move think a cat. Oh, no, okay. Okay. That, that one-click druid. There uh, one second. One second. NPC... No all and did we have any rest between uh our last fight and just a few minutes not yet Uh -uh. okay just making sure that player's handbook let's see what this yeah here you go sweet okay i have two hit points as a cat so it means if i get Uh two hit points or two hits two points of damage i turn back to myself plenty of healing spells oh yeah no it's fine it's fine it's not a big deal okay so y'all come around isra and sorrow what are y'all doing uh isra's carrying Isra's... Me, so whatever isra does isra's gonna stay kind of she's gonna follow vix and Maz and trying to step where they're stepping so that i don't make a lot of noise and uh, keep the slaves right behind, like, following. She's kind of keeping an eye on them. Okay. Sorrow moves are over there, too. Making a deal. And y'all come around. Moss and um, Vix kind of come around, and you're seeing what looks to like a courtyard area. And more buildings to kind of make, you know, you're in like a little cul-de-sac. Kind of hard to see, does, but yeah. Any does anything look noise? disturbed? Like people have walked through here recently, or is it all pretty? <laughs> pretty much dilapidated, gr- grown over with you know some foliage. I mean, like there's not like seen... tracks in the no. foliage or anything no. like that. No? Nope. Nope. Uh, slowly make my way uh, left, west, yep. trying to stick kind of close to the buildings and not really yep. go out. Yeah, you're moving in, and you're area. you're. Can just really see that it's kind of hard to tell because of the darkness of the map, but you move through there. Oh no, hold on now. Um, oh. and you move through there. Make me a perception check, Vix. I'm gonna boot myself if that's all right. 
Nice. You Ooh. hear orc voices coming oh, through shit. the foliage to your west. And you hear you hear walking. Uh, and, I'm going to quickly message Isra and tell her to get on in cover. Uh, and I'm going to grab Moss and kind of duck behind this building. Duff, this house that on it. we're at, is there an entrance on this mm-hmm. side? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I shoo the slaves inside and, and me and Raccoon Sorrow follow. Yeah, sorry. Let me make okay. more room for Moss. And then once we're inside, I'm looking for a window over here for me to try and peek out. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's a good idea. That's fine, yeah. Y'all are sitting there watching, and then all of a sudden, on the road, you see what looks like a road that kind of cuts through, you know, kind of a little, what, you know, some mud paved track, you know, that would have been a major road at the time, and standing there are these guys. I guess we have Moss this time who can understand Orcish. What they're saying. <laughs> yeah. That make was me, an issue last time. Make me a perception Sorry. check, Moss. No. Okay. That's not your fault, Moss. <laughs> we left yeah, you. No, no, no. We did. We left you behind. You were, you were hanging <laughs> with slaves. Keep an eye on him. Okay. Yep. They're patrolling. Kind of walking through here. They're actually, they were, they're headed in. Uh, looking, uh, yeah, they're, yeah, they're just, it's a regular patrol mowing through some of this area. It looks like that they're talking about that maybe clearing some of it out to set up another, they need space or renovated space with the more orcs that are coming in, uh, from the South, uh, they're needing more campsites and do any of them have yellow sashes? They all have yellow sashes on. Okay, yes. thank you. Yeah, <laughs> if I yes. can speak. Or it's just these are, nice these are heavy regiment heavy regiment orcs. Oh, yep. I know, right. They they and okay. they're saying, yeah, make sure keep close yeah, keep close together. Uh checking things out. Uh there's you know they undead about, gassed about. Keep if we hear any flapping noises, duck, light a torch. Some people, nah, that's not really, that really didn't happen, did it? You know, talk about that, because these, you know, these sound like they're they're not from here, originally. Okay. But they're kind of mulling about we here. wait for them on. to move Yeah, on. are they, like, walking mm-hmm. past? Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're going in, they're going deeper. They're going north into the area where y'all are supposed to go through. How convenient, okay. right? Okay. That's what I thought. Okay. Uh, let's see. Players, how do I grab these dudes? Oh, really? Where is it? Over here. Selection mode. Thank you. All right. They disappear out of view. Okay. I'm going to message Isra once I know that the coast is clear. Um, me and my raccoon buddy will pop out with the slaves following. Okay, so which, where, what do you think? Where do we want to go? I think we want to, we want to go in the direction that they're going. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. I so just head north. Up. Yeah, try to. Is there anything? Can we see across the street, or is it too dark to see if there's like? It's kind of dark. Well, your dark percent. vision plays okay. off on, of, but you're seeing. Uh, it's fair to ask. Looking around, you're going to see. Looks like what was left of a structure, and there's maybe another one right off into the south. Hey, uh, how about my? Uh spyglass that i never use because it was backfired on why i bought it does that help us out at all spyglass at nighttime 
Oh yeah, nighttime. That was that was the whole issue last time. That was the whole issue. Okay, once it gets light out, somebody remind me to use that so we can see further. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna use she that holds it up, and she—you see, her, she's actually got it backwards, and then she's looking at it right, but she's looking at it backwards again. I did not again. roll one, sir. I did not roll a one. <laughs> I was like, wait, I could use the. Oh wait, it's dark out. Damn it! Damn it again! Just stick it back in my pocket. Uh, I'm just gonna I'm move gonna... up and kind of keep close to the building and kind of peer out to see where the street goes. You'll see that it opens up into a courtyard area. And the orcs are kind of hanging out there looking around. Make me another stealth check in the tower, please. All of us? You. Eyes are didn't move. I'm, I'm gonna, right behind I'm her. Also... Do you want a stealth check from me? Oh, yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Hopefully that was good. I see one. Vic stealth. Okay. All right. I was, I was saying, why is the D4 there? You booped yourself. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I booped myself. Sorry. Yeah. Dang, I was like, what? It's not, for whatever reason, my guidance isn't like programmed correctly, coded correctly. What? What? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe see. it is, and I just, and, and you fixed it, and I just continue to do the same thing see. that I, I've it? always done. Where is Possible. guidance? And so it should <laughs> be 1D4 check. Oh, well, you, it, it yeah. So, it's supposed to be on your no targets. Never. It's, it should just it rolled the D four after you made your roll. Oh no, because I did that manually. So like, if, oh, I if put you, it you on put myself, the effect on you. On. Oh, now it does. Last yeah. like the last couple of times I've tried to use it, it didn't. It yeah, didn't. I like I like that roll. You should use that roll there, Duff. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh, yeah, uh -huh. that's a good roll, Duff. I think you mm -hmm. should. Look at that roll, uh -huh. Duff. Why do I feel like your last roll wasn't that good? Nope. Probably not. You're fine. They're just mulling about. Okay. They don't. They're not paying attention. They're looking at a couple of buildings, and like I said, there's a building. They're kind of looking at left and right from what your viewpoint, and yeah, they kind of they're sitting there, and they will then um, three of them kind of move over this way, and the other three, other four. Kind of move here. One kind of does his own thing. Kind of breaks off. It's kind of standing about. Sharpening his sword. They're just chilling. Okay. Uh, can I'm we maybe message Isra? Should we take care of them or? I mean, I think if we don't, we're going to get caught. Table no. talk DM has my has my ring attuned now that we've been out in the evening you, under the stars. You need eight hours of downtime to attune to it. A, a long really? rest. Uh -huh. right? I thought it was a short rest. I thought attunement was a long rest. Someone, someone correct so. me, please. Or... Attunement. That was a long rest. Or could I spell attunement? Five e. I can't remember honestly. So, um, you got to gain it. Spending time to bond. Um, what's up, Jay? Good to see you. Um, oh crap! Really? Come on, just give me a damn Start answer. Rest. Is it a short rest? To an item attuning to an item requires a creature to spend a short rest focused on only that item while being in physical contact. Did you spend only on that then? That means you have to let think... go of the raccoon. Well, I don't think we've technically taken a short rest. You haven't taken one. No, we so... haven't. Uh, yeah. Dang it. I mean, okay. we've taken a long rest, though. Since yeah, we took a long rest in the in that stable area. I wasn't really out in the under the night sky. Did you do it then? Yeah, think, that's true. That's are, true. You gonna, are you gonna are you gonna retcon yeah, me and tell me you like, did it then? Even... No, because we were in the stable duff, and that's not how this ring works. And I I'm not gonna do that. Ice is a good D and D player, duff. <laughs> she follows the rules. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, she'll attune to it when she gets a chance. Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Oh, so here's what I'm That's thinking. That's fair. What if we, um, like, if I were to stealthily, since I have all sorts of inspiration points, if I F this up, how about I run across behind the building to our west? It looks like it's kind of in darkness, but I think that's a building. <laughs> And we do ranged attacks at them uh, from different spots. Like if Vic stays where she is, I go over there, you know, maybe, what is that, 40 feet west of us. And we hit them from different areas. They don't won't know where it's coming from. And element of surprise, perhaps. And confusion. Wow. Hey, you've got a house. They're not that bright. Yeah, you got a dilapidated house that's that y'all are up against on your right hand side, the courtyard. You saw a little house that's in the center, then there was more kind of a walkway, and then there was another house that was kind of right off there. You kind of see like it. Like if I moved here, Duff, like if I moved. Well, you can there. run across there, but yeah, you're, yeah, they have a, um, they're going to be making some rolls to see if they see you run across. You're going to make another stealth roll. You can't do that, right. yes, but you're out in the open. And it's dark out. Hey, oh, most certainly. But they have dark vision. You know that. True. So they can see. But the question is, will they see you? I, that's, that is the chance that you take. May okay. I, and when, if they... Go ahead. I was going to say, go when ahead, Moss then. wants to run out, may I cast a spell as Moss goes to run to kind of do a distraction? You, y'all tell me how you want to play it. I uh, have no problem with that. I would, I would like to cast Ice Storm. Which would do what? What's that? Uh, it is a, a, a hail of rock hard ice pounds to the ground in a 20 foot radius, 40 foot high cylinder centered on a point within range. Each Are creature you... in the cylinder must make a dex throw. Okay. If you drop so it on them, that initiate, storm. that awesome. initiates, that'll initiate combat or at least turn order. So mm -hmm. yeah. Why don't so, you let Why don't you let me run, and then if I screw it up and <laughs> whatnot, then do it. Can we do it that way? Well, they may see you. Then that would initiate it also. Then so so. Well, I'm a little reckless, and I have two inspiration points. So y'all are standing Wait, next. With... Y'all are standing next to each other. So someone has to make a decision. What's going to happen here? Okay. So first of all, does Sara want to pop out of? Uh, wild Rapid shape, or mode. she want to stay in wild shape? Yeah, I, I, I sort of like, she's like, Sorrow, do you want down? Squeak once for yes, twice for no. We're going in. Squeak. Squeak. I, I put the raccoon down. <laughs> okay. All right. Sorrow takes the time to stop being a raccoon. And then I'm going to signal to Moss to, to go ahead and go run try to run across. Okay. So okay. is that a stealth roll? That is a stealth roll in the tower. Oh, why are you always doing the tower? I want to know what I rolled. I know you do. <laughs> good dice. Be good dice. But I will tell you if it's not good. Her bad her bad uh, that's not, it's not that bad. Okay, hold on. So okay. We've got, so we got, uh, like I said, I'm going to roll three of them. A couple other two are looking in the building. So we've got a exception check. One. Two. I'm letting you see their roles. Uh, thank you, thank you, and thank you. Yeah. Those are shit rolls, Duff. Ooh, <laughs> yeah, they rolls, are. Duff. They are they're <laughs> shit rolls. <laughs> so, ta-da! I get yeah. across and no one sees me. She gets across Yay! and no one, no one saw you as you skimmered across. Okay. Awesome. Okay. Scamper, scamper, scamper. All right, so we... Split the party on two different sides. Now, do we want? Uh, is Izra gonna get? I mean, is she Isra. in range to really do anything? Or I mean, Izra wants to get up close and personal. Um, what's this range? Thirty feet. Okay. So man, we should, yeah. we should have had sorrow go up and steal some of their food or something <clears throat> as the raccoon. <laughs> okay. Eyes were, were you paying, were you, but were you paying attention to this? Eyes yeah. Knows what's up. Vix had was she? me asking my opinion. And my opinion was that we need to take them out. I see yeah. that Moss move. So I'm like, okay, we're going in. 
Okay. Um, I will cast Bless on Vix, myself, and Sorrow because Moss is out of range. And that is what I'm going to do before we start this. Okay. Duff, uh, can I see around that building that I'm at now? Uh huh. One Just second. Any further? All right. All right, so you're going to see, you'll see a house. Um, you see it ends, and there's another house right due west, and then you see a you know the courtyard, you know streets going off back behind you to another dilapidated house. So there's a house directly to your west. So, Moss has moved. Vix, what are you doing? Uh, I am going to... Uh, sorry, what do I want to do? Uh, I'm going to fire off uh, a guiding bolt. You're going to... Just to kind of to, to jump us in, if that's all right with everyone. Hey, okay. yep. Yeah. Okay, she calls it, folks. All right, so you've got yeah, some orcs you. there, honey. Yeah, I'm gonna peek out and try to get onto a uh, orc. All the right, long ranger over here. Okay, that was a hit. You slammed one into the back. One slam into him. Roll initiative. Awesome. I'm sorry, uh, Moss. You're not, you weren't great. <laughs> I just had to Olaf that for a second. Uh, I know. Oh, freaking frick. <laughs> Damn. Freaking frick. <laughs> freaking frick, frick. <laughs> Is that? Dude, my kids pick up everything I say. I'm trying to be better. <laughs> Someone asked a question. Is that what? Hold on. I need. You need to minus the three from mine. What happened? Oh, you uh, didn't. Oh, you didn't have inspiration. I mean, you were. See, the yeah. guidance was. So that's the. That's the. Thing it has. That yeah, you have the to remove it. Doesn't expire. It, it doesn't. Normally, no. it should just expire automatically. Uh, I change that, it here. Uh, I, here. Jana what had you did? Yeah, hold on. I'll show you. It's go to one second, folks. Bring up your character sheet. Sorry, guys. Ah, darn it. Where is and then go to guidance and then underneath there, expanding on next roll. There you go. Okay. Yep. And we'll expand out. Now, so you said take three out of it? Yeah, take three. So it should be a... 18. 18, yeah. 17. Okay. So 18, top yeah. of the order. All right, Moss, you hear Wump and the, an orc screams out. And here, top of the order. All right. And so... if, you hit, if you hit orc seven, you'll have advantage on him because he got guiding bolted. Uh... Oh, well, kind of in there. she's kind of. Where is I'm which one is seven? The far He's that right. She would have saw because oh, I. Yeah. Oh yeah, that one. Yeah, okay. Because I guiding bolted him, so. Uh, He's glowing see. right now. I can hit him. I do believe. All right, let's try this. It's been a week <laughs> or two. <It's> <laughs> let's see how this goes. I have faith in myself. All right. I have targeted Orc 7. I am going to shoot at him with my short bow. Short bow? Let's see if I hit him. Wow. Oh, Yeah, we're no. going to re-roll that bad boy. That was like an awesomely bad roll. Ooh. All right, let's try that again. Let's try. Oh, Jesus. Does a 12 Ooh. You should roll with advantage, though. That's true. Do you it's not guiding bolts? Guiding bolt doesn't have an effect for it. Do you put that on them? Let me see. I didn't, and then it got it, it expired for some reason. I don't know why. What's up, Armin? Uh, I, yeah, if you put it, yeah, roll. Yeah, it's well, don't put it on him now, but take yeah, roll that roll that attack one more time, Lori. Just straight Just up. Roll it. Yeah, Vix, take yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Work. Take that off of him before she rolls, cause he yeah. Here, I mean, okay. there we go. Make that attack roll one more time. 
Miss, miss, miss. Jeez, oh, what is with darn. these rolls? It's a hit. Hey, but it's a hit. I know. I know, but it's a What's up, Armin? What's up, Down Under? Good to see you. All right. And because I suck at this, I... Is the sneak attack? Yes? Uh, no. You have to be... With or your rakish audacity, right? That's what you've got. Don't you have that? Um, yeah, I have that. To have yeah. it. Um, no other creature than your target is within five feet. Of, well, she's got advantage. Yeah. Yeah, actually, you right. did get advantage. So that would give you sneak attack. Okay. Nice. That's what I was like unclear in the well, situation. She got advantage on the roll, but she still has... Someone either has to be next to him or she has to be by herself next to him to get the sneak attack. That's okay, only so if she I doesn't don't. have advantage on the roll. Yeah. I was say, I That's the rakish audacity. Advantage. For just normal sneak attack. And give uh, it to her. I thought you had yeah, I thought someone had to be next to her. Well that's for yeah, the I rakish could... that's that's her subclass feature. Yeah, it says no creature other than your target is within five feet of you. So rakish doesn't go there. So, right, but if you read sneak yeah. attack, it says anytime you have advantage. But yeah, you get for normal it. sneak Correct? attack, like the rogue feature. You yeah, don't need advantage on the attack roll. Oh, that's right. There you go. Yeah, that, I always do that backwards. Yep, you got sneak attack. <laughs> I always right. do it backwards. I've been doing this for years now. I still get it mixed up. So do you know yeah, how to? Do you remember so how to do rolls. that, Lori? Yep. Look at that. Look I at just that. did it. Yeah. Look at that. Lori figuring out the computers. Let's see now, <laughs> everyone. Roll good. Oh, oh, oh. Eh, yeah, that's not bad. Good enough. Slams into him. Yeah. Bam, I always murders. get it wrong, Josh. So what? Hey. Okay. Uh, Moss always gets it wrong, too. <laughs> All right. It's why like, well, you have your backup. Then, right? Uh, and then I think I will... Cruise my happy butt around the back of this building with my ability to do so. Okay, and you will see, see... if I can see anything else. Yeah, you're going to see more buildings. Okay. Uh, how many? Did I just moved thirty, right? But I didn't move earlier, so can I move a total of sixty still? Or you is can it use your cunning after action. I make an action. Okay. No, you did your action, sure. so your cunning action allows you to continue to dash. Okay, but I've already gone, let's see. So You've gone gonna 30. Go, I'm going to go there, just so I can target those guys after this turn. Yeah, and yeah. then I'm I square. am... I'm kind, yeah, I'm in a square. Okay, I'm done. Okay, let's see. Miss Vix. Uh, all right, one second. <clears throat> this way, if Isra or Vix's situation goes bad, that I could distract them to keep them away from the slaves is kind of what I'm trying to do Yeah, here. so the orcs, a couple of these orcs that are out in the courtyard, there's some that were peering in, you know, looking in the buildings <laughs> and all that. And is this a bit like... Damn, this map sometime is... That's just courtyard. Hold on. Oh my god. Gosh darn it. Quit. Okay, that's just. Okay, that's just. Yeah, there's not. That's not a building there. Okay, that's just open courtyard. Okay. Courtyard. Yeah, it's just. Yeah, it's. Just, it was. It was once a building. There's nothing there. Uh, and turn. they turn. Yeah, they, most of these orcs, except for a couple over there in the building that's directly in front of Moss, um, they turn to see their friend. You know. Really, on you know, dying on the ground, and they <laughs> scream out because oh, across the courtyard that y'all can see from y'all's angle, these creatures kind of bash out of the building, and they are where are they? Dun -dun. Of our undead friends, what the oh, heck is gosh. that? Skeletons, oh, okay, skeletons. cool. Okay, yeah, from the noise, yep, from the noise of a guy getting hit with an arrow, he screamed out, 
He died. Ouch. Okay. He said ouch. It's death rattle. It's death That's rattle. right. Okay. And uh Isra and Sorrow, maybe perception checks, please. You got it. Uh tower, not tower. You just make it out in the open. Thank you. <laughs> Do I need that perception? <laughs> you failed, Isra didn't. I know. Okay. It's okay. Isra can tell me what's going on. Isra's gonna see that y'all are gonna be seeing you're gonna look. Um there's a little nook, little um break between the houses right here. Yeah. And there's a house right over there that y'all can see. Let me show you, you know, and coming out of that house. Front row. Oh, Shit. oh, too uh -huh. close oh, for comfort. Okay. Cool, 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 oh, dear. But they are, they are, they are coming out of that house, of the area, but they're going toward the courtyard. They're not coming toward y'all. Just so oh. you know. Oh, that's Beautiful. good. Okay. Yeah, they're, they're going to where the noise was at. And it seems shambling out. And that is kind of what they do. And let me make the movements. They kind of burst through buildings and, uh, you know. Uh. Like you do when you're undead. That's right. I mean, you know, uh. like a zombie type creature does. Yeah, that's right. Um, And they actually, uh, let me say how many other, one, two, three, four, five, there's four of them. Seven of them. Let's say three of them shoot some arrows. They got little short Sorry. bows. Is there just... really a one? That is horrible. <laughs> <laughs> You're rolling. Lori, like you crap said though. like a zombie, and in my head, I heard Madonna's like a virgin, but like a zombie. Like a zombie. <laughs> <laughs> really? Uh, I don't know what they would do for the very first time, but sure. Oh man, really? My channel? Really? I just lost all my viewers. We just lost them all. Alright. They, all, they all left the channel. Thanks a lot. Fix. Oh. Duff. That's rude. You're rude. Duff. That's rude, Duff. Uh, I am going to take out my crossbow and shoot fork number 12. Uh, so that's actually, so I get nice. that damage, and then I also get that damage from my Blessed Strike. It would roll. <laughs> oh my god, it's not rolling. What are you doing? I'm trying to roll for my Blessed Strike. Did, Did he see. die? Uh, orcs? Not yet. Yeah. There goes. There goes the roll. I, I, I had the next. Well, where is your blessed strike? It's is it not coded? Two. It's. I don't. Is it? I don't know. Where is your blessed strike? Oh, it is. I'm just an idiot. It's fine. It's new. It's a new ability. Get that. Get that. Someone clip that, please. So I'm an idiot. Wow. <laughs> it's a new ability. Okay. I don't know how it works yet. <laughs> Who are you shooting? Which orc number twelve? So I got to give him uh, two yeah, more. Orc All right. Number twelve. So I, I got it. Yeah. Real good. I'll remember. For Great hit for who? Isra? Oh, come on. <gasps> it doesn't need it. Thank you. So many right, appreciated else? my my like a zombie. Thank you, Celtic. Zombie. God. Uh, are you going to do anything else, Vix? You're going to pass I your turn. I totally have to finish that now. Um. No, I'm going to stay where I am. Okay. And then that's going to be it from me. Hey, okay. Sorrow. Um, Azra, did you, did you mention or motion to Sorrow about the skeletons? It's, it's, it hasn't been my turn yet. It's not a turn yet. Okay. I'll just, I'll so then Sorrow doesn't know about it, really. So she's no. going to move up next Sorrow should run that way. Fix. Ignorance is bliss, man. Yeah. Uh, I don't know stealth, anything. stealth roll, please. 
You move into the open area. Oh, okay. Are we still being stealthy? I thought we were already attacking. No, but I'm just saying if they're paying it, if the orcs see you run toward Vix. Actually, Vix just shot, so never mind. So they're going to okay. know that she's there. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Never mind. You're good. Cool. Sorry. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> it's not your fault. It's not your fault, Boo Boo. It's not your fault. <laughs> oh, fuck. Ooh, no. Language? I'm sorry. Potty Can mouth. Good. I'm the worst. I'm the worst about that. I'll use my inspiration to re-roll that, please. Yeah, I'm teasing. Yes. Trust me, you're not the worst. Dice color. <laughs> yeah. Hit. Nice. Not the best damage, okay. but still damage. Mm -hmm. Hey. Um. Well. Um. As a bonus a action, orc. the orc can move up to its speed to hostile creatures. So a bonus action, charged y'all, swinging at Vix. Really? Oh, good. <laughs> well, or fifteen. That's not so bad. Well, yeah, we basically charged into. Actually, is going to move right here, and then we'll. So the orcs and the skeletons are cool with each other? No, they're not. Okay. Oh, they're fighting they're each other. Too. Cool. Yeah, but I was wondering. Yeah, I don't think I've ever played in a game where the opponents started fighting each other. Yeah. Kind of awesome. I love it. I love it. Split focus always good for us. Right? Ah, oh, shit. It's uh -oh. fine. Not the it's child. fine. It's fine. Why is that heavy? Right? How is it heavy? <laughs> <coughs> I guess because it's more than half. Ooh. God, you're not a raccoon. Oh, no. Right. Well, that's not good. What's going on? You just got oh, hit. No. You got hit. You got hit. hit with a crit. Uh, destructive wrath. Wrath the Storm, whatever the fuck that ability is. Wrath the Storm. <laughs> Who hit me? Uh, orc number two. Uh, orc two. With a crossbow bolt. Because he's a dick. Yeah. Come on, make it, make it. What was that? Oh, oh. some poison on the uh, crossbow bolt. Hey. Come on, man. Yeesh. Don't, oof. Don't hit me when I'm down. He's trying to he get failed. me fucking down. Oh, my gosh. Oh, Heavy. Boy. Okay. Who? Oh. Twenty-two. Uh, um, which way is gonna go? Uh, let's see. Uh, odd toward y'all, even toward the skeletons. Okay. All right. One, two, three, four. He will charge in. Y'all, some of y'all can't see, but he's got. There's another house right here. He charge. Oh, oh, darn it! It's really tough. <laughs> And he charges in. Not scared. Ain't scared, no skellies. <laughs> but whiffs. Way to go, dork. Uh, <laughs> odd toward the girls, even toward the skellies. Even toward <laughs> the skellies. Hey. There's more right. of them. That, that, that they know of, yeah. God, I can't hit the quad side. They don't seem our R20 slaves hiding. <laughs> God, man. We're okay Isra. with that. <laughs> right, so, uh, first, Isra turns around and slaves. It's like, get your asses back in that house. Then she's going to run. But we want to see what's going on. It's kind of fun to watch y'all fight stuff because y'all are really good at it. And we like seeing them and then like cheer you on. And we we'll step here and throw. <laughs> Can we just throw the little boy in the middle of everything? Like, seriously? No. No. <laughs> Wait, do I have to be. I think I have to. Touch. Hold on, I gotta check something. No touchy. Fifteen. I reach out and touch Vix, and dump all of my lay on hands into her. So thirty-five points of healing. All of my love. Wow. Mm -hmm. And then I will go. So that's fifteen. Twenty. 
25, 30, and get behind these guys. Uh, hey. So that's action, movement. I don't have anything for my bonus action because I have a concentration spell right now. So that's it for me. Okay. Um... Oh, this is sad. Uh, oh, no. Maslani, you hear what? wailing coming out of the buildings that you are centered in and oh, no. sh shambling oh, no. out of oh, the shit. buildings, raging, are some oh, friends shit. that y'all got rid of. Not those, those guys no. Yeah, no, no, they, no, no. They, the, they're the no. ones that y'all yeah, made go boo away from the compound and here they come out, and two of them come out of the buildings and see you. Another oh, one comes out of the buildings and charges right behind Isra. Another one comes out of the building, charging out of Isra. And another one, all the way across the courtyard, which y'all will see, comes out. Oh, dear. Okay, uh, Moss it's not, it's not would it's like It's not your turn use... yet. It's not your turn yet. It's not? Nope, oh, I thought it was. I'm just letting Sorry. you know you oh, hear them scream uh, as they come uh, out of the buildings because they're hungry and upset. Balls. Yep. And, uh, we'll, we'll, let's see. We'll give some bites first. Uh, no. <laughs> Seventeen is here. Come up behind Isra. Wait, 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 wait. I don't see seventeen. Do you not? Do you not have it uncovered? Oh, sorry. No, there. thank you. It's yeah, sorry. invisible. Sorry, I moved him without it exposing him. Hey, okay. another one is out. Miss number four. Ugh. Nice to get Moss. Miss it. They miss. Miss it. And seven. Yes. I believe yeah, seven's up there with the orc and tries to bite the orc. Oh no, bite the skeleton. No, not the skeleton. One for the orc. You would orc. bite the orc. I would. No, I'm biting the orc, not biting the skeleton. Yeah. There's no meat on the Where's bone that for one? the skeleton. There's no meat on the bone. <laughs> <laughs> Missing. Wow. I suck. Commoners, do they attack? Charge! No, oh, they don't. No. Duff, where's Didn't we tell them to hide? You put them in that building, Duff. What's that, Kirsten? What? You're asking uh, something? Where's, that? where's <laughs> rule number seven? It's not on the map. Oh, sorry. I'm, I'm not exposing them. Thank you. Try not to expose. Okay. Expose How about I mean, right here, that. since it's, it's 1030, let's take our quick break since we're at the top of the order again. Sure. Okay. Um, and it looks like we're going to go longer than our normal... Or, or I was going to cut it here, but we're in combat, so having some fun. So, uh, yeah, you know what? So that's that's what we're going to do, folks. Again, I don't have anything prepped. I'm an idiot. Um, so anyway, uh, sit down, have our intermission here real quick. We'll be back here in about five minutes or so. Uh, so don't go away because they're in the middle of combat, and i got to hit the right button. We'll see you in a little bit. service at our snack bar where you'll find a tempting variety of favorite foods and beverages now it's showtime folks and you can be sure it's the best show in town your continued patronage is very very welcome setting up shop we got a cleric paladin who is also setting up shop we're gonna call our consortium freighters haberdashery consortium we don't sell hats is we don't sell hats part of the name no, I just thought I'd clarify. Oh, I like it better if it was part of the name. Yeah, me too. Oh, oh, really like that would be you, very I mean, funny. I mean, I'm the head of it, so like I could, we could add that to the name. Yeah, we will then. We're gonna have shirts made. I gotta get their portraits <laughs> all put together, and we're gonna have merchandise. Oh my god! 
This is gonna be awesome. Raiders Haberdashery Consortium. Parentheses, we don't sell hats. I would buy one of those shirts. It's intermission. Rise and stretch time. Time to refresh yourself and visit our snack bar. Got a yen for hot popcorn? Your favorite soft drinks are sparkling cold. The juicy Frank sizzling hot. There's delicious coffee freshly brewed and all kinds of ice cream and candy to tempt you. Showtime will be announced loud and clear to get you back to your car in time. So stretch your legs. Come to the snack bar now. They don't really apply to level zero crits. So they don't? Okay. All right, so then I won't grab them. I thought that crit might be that extra one. Okay, so here's the regular damage. Uh, oh, say good night, Francis. Oh, that's Chip. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Chip. Suck it, Chip. <laughs> Whoops. You uh, I You're thought too I kidding me. Oh. I'm sorry, sir. This is a private mountain. But I only wanted it. This mountain is reserved for patrons. But, but, but It's I... a supply depot for all sorts of good things, which people can get at the snack bar. Like soft drinks, candy bars of all kinds, delicious popcorn, and refreshing ice cream treats. But I am a patron of... Well, why didn't you say so? Be our guest. And you're kind of at a point where you can't really wedge your way in there anymore. You're like... Eh. Here, boy. Here, boy. Come, come. Here, here, boy. You can do it. Come on. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, may I help you? Uh, I'd like two of those, please. Hot dogs? Yes, sir. And three of those. And one of those. And five bars of these. And a cup of that nice hot liquid. Uh, coffee. Uh, coming right up. Oh, and two bags of those peculiar white puffy material. Uh, you mean our crunchy popcorn. Uh, uh, shall I wrap that for you, sir? Oh, that's all right. My saucer's just outside. <laughs> they come from miles to enjoy our intermission. So I'm, I, I'm terribly sorry. Bjorn, you explode, and in your place is a sweet roll. Nice. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, hello there. Give the demonstration of my new invention, the goodies machine. The machine turns out delicious hot doggies one after the other. And thirst quenching sodas also. Gives popcorn of the most tasty kind, plain and buttered. Candy too, crunchy and dandy. Steaming hot coffee and ice cream too. These goodies are at a snack bar just waiting for you. Mm. Private messenger. Then do you know how to do that in Facebook? I mean, in fa Facebook, whatever. What the hell? I'm, what the hell? What the hell? At least Facebook is still around. <laughs> Wow. Years into the future. <laughs> the, why mess with a good thing, Go ahead and right? clip that one, guys. So you can send that one to me later, too. Thanks a lot. As everyone um, knows, rainbows usually have a treasure at the end. Let's follow this one and see if we can find the pot of gold. Brother, and I suppose you've come to claim a treasure. Well, we'd like to see the gold first. Nathan, there's better than gold in here, me lad. No, no, just look here, no. Candy. Refreshing soft drinks. Popcorn. Ice cream? Well, that's some treasure, but anyone can buy luscious treats like these at the snack bar. You don't tell me! Uh, do you suppose you could get me a job as a snack bar attendant? Brass knuckles he's wearing, and uh, the, the creature just... How did the creature do? <laughs> One more time? Not that. That was it. <laughs>
Like you crave that corn when it's freshly bopped. You gotta beat it to the box with the butter on the top. Get with it, man. Start strolling down to the sweets that you roll in the best in town. Our candy's real gone, if I'm understood. To all you squares, that means the confection is positively delicious. Cork that stuff. Give me five. Let me send you into this nutty jive. <laughs> Shake it on down to this cool snack bar. Come on, Jill, give us a treat. A friendly pepper upper with a tasty beat. Drink Dr. Pepper, Dr. Dr. Pepper, cause it never let you down. Frosty, man, frosty. People, we might be able to take care of that. I understand. I'm gonna sing the theme song now. Oh, God. Music to the ears of the hungry. The sizzle of a mouth-watering hamburger. Fresh, lean beef, done to a golden brown, couched in a soft bun, and garnished to taste. Man, that's hunger heaven. And you'll feel like you're heaven sent when you get one at our refreshment stand. Happen, let me see, is there a deception check for a horse? Does a horse have a... Ooh, something. Only deception for a horse? Yeah, a horse I has got deception. <laughs> So the horse goes up and you see it. It's looking a brief second. It looks at the plant like maybe, you know, that's it's something even tastier. But then it, it sticks out his tongue and then and it, you know, pulls back, you know. And then it and it backs up. It's got the it's got the sugar cube in its mouth and and its eyes go boing as his eyes just go and it starts Woo! and it starts bucking and you know and it just <laughs> And he was looking at something in his hand, and he is standing up, and he grunts out, Who the F are you? What are you doing here? Housekeeping? Housekeeping? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dead. my God. Your attention, please. All new hotshot electric in-car heaters have been installed for your comfort and convenience. Just insert heater through car window and turn on the switch. When leaving, please turn switch off and replace on speaker post. Warning, high voltage. For your own safety, do not attempt to repair or remove wires. Do not attempt to open heater unit. If you need assistance, please notify the theater box office or concession manager. Tries a little half tater tots. Too. We're back, folks. Waffle fries. Thank you for sticking mm -hmm. around Waffle fries for the rejects. Here on Saturday night. Hope you all enjoying your weekend. Fries of milkshake. Waterburger. Mm -hmm. okay. Can we get that as a sponsor? That'd be great. We'll get it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they like D&D. Yeah, you sure. Betcha. They love they love any any type of nighttime See, long shot. that is not you know sh showing up drunk to the bar. Hey. Uh, so we're in the middle of combat. We're top of the order. Uh, and Maslani is got some ghoulies on her. Yeah, those guys can piss off. I am going to disengage. 
Okay, and then what? So, and then I'm going to climb on top of this house. Okay, I need so I'm a. Guessing I have to I need an acrobatics check. check. Uh huh. Uh huh. And okay, really? No. That would be I'm a failure. I'm gonna re-roll that. Shh, zip it. <laughs> I'm gonna re-roll that. Fail, 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 fail. There you go. Okay. It moves you up so, to the top of the wall. There is no roof on this house, though. But I'm far enough where I'm not in reach. You're up 20 those feet. Guys. You're up to, Yeah, the rest of your movement. Yeah, it's, I'd say it's you know a, a single story house, so it's a 10 foot or 12 footer. So you're about 15 feet. Yeah. So you're up. Yeah, up okay. on the top of the wall there, away from them as they look. As they were so, swiping at you as you moved away. I don't know. Like. So what I? No, I guess that's where I am. Okay. So. Then I am going to, oh, I want to use it. I just want to use it so bad. I want to use the laughter spell. Oh, it's not time yet. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna shoot one of these guys. I'll shoot at number 15, ghoul number 15 with an arrow in the billiard room. With, uh, where is, there I am. There we go. So, I'm gonna hit him. Hopefully, hopefully I hit the right button. Come on, where are you at? I'm just wasting time until I fucking, where to go? Actions, there we go. All right. Shut up, Duff. Get there. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot at him. There we go. Hit. That's beautiful. You think? Okay. There is no sneak attack damage on this. Okay. I was like, e no. I always just hope that you're going to pretend that I, I get something. No. Ew. Okay. Well, that wasn't much. I shoot him in the arm. There's an arrow sticking Owie. out. That's not even remotely good. So, yeah, that's my turn. Owie. But I've got a better vantage point. Can I see everything from the vantage point I'm at now? Stuff. Like, oh, yeah, I just meant all the baddies. Oh, I could see everything, everything. Cool. I was just getting the combat set and getting into it. That's all I can. You know, the rest is just ruins and was some type of, you know, okay. humanoid area, you know, you know, housing area that's mostly ruined now. Sure, sure. That's all. Okay, I'm done. All right, skellies, 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 skellies. They're going to attack. The orky orky orkies. Alright. Back. It's. <coughs> One, ten. Back. Miss. Be great Whiff. if they could just take each other out. I know. Whiff. Well, not the way I roll. You kidding me? Why can't you roll like that when hitting us? Right? Right? And 23. Okay. Down 24. Miss. <laughs> I can't do anything. Oh, there's a hit. Killed an orc. Nice. All righty. Well, I think it's part of our job. Big Sarah. On the same side or not? Do what now? Oh, the ghoul and the skeletons, if they're on the same side. They're undead. Oh, okay. The ghoul's same not. Yeah the, yeah, the ghoul's got no one, no skeletons, no bones. There's no meat on no, the bones. Yeah. Yeah. That's no good. Uh, Just like eating a toothpick. Come on, Vix, do some. I don't know what Vix is doing. She's getting ready to blast y'all yourselves. No. I'm going to cast uh, Spirit Guardians and make sure that <laughs> yes. they don't attack Sorrow, Isra, or Moss, who I can now see because she's on top of the building, right? Nice. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Moss is way over there, though. 
Yeah, but I can see but I see her, so I'm making sure that they know not to attack Moss. Oh, gotcha, you, gotcha. Over. Well, they don't. Yeah, they stay only in the circle, so yeah, they won't fly over there. But yeah, okay. Yeah, but I'm just uh, saying, like, in case she comes over to us and yeah. she enters the circle, she will. Don't be uh, telegraphing yeah, just, a move there. You just, you know, hey. No, I'm just saying. I'm I'm trying to think ahead in case she comes back over to mm -hmm. us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh. I'm going to, uh, yeah, I'm going to cast that so my little carnivorous snow fairies just emerge up and start circling around and trying to bite at whatever uh, whatever I say isn't isn't chill with us. Okay. And so yeah, they after their yeah, turn, yeah they're they flitting around. Like a, yeah, on their turn, you're going to give them some saves. Sorrow. Um. I. Yes, I'm just gonna keep it simple with a shocking grasp of the one in front of me. Ooh, nice. That's nice. And I'm gonna bonus action healing sir or I'm sorry, second wind on myself. Okay. Okay, uh, saving throw. Six or 12. And that's for. Or 12, please. Do I, do I have control over the commoners now? No, you did not. It was commoners I alone. Have control <laughs> over the commoners. I'm going to, you know what? I'm going to change that right now. You can't. So now they're neutral. Oh. Now you can't target oh. them. Now they're gonna. Wah, I wah. control them. They're going to come. Are they we're really? Gonna, we're gonna see what's happening. Oh, <sighs> it's not their turn I don't yet. Know what, I don't know, but you've got to give this orc twelve a save, please. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing Any day it. now. Give me a second. <laughs> I have very little room to work with. Oh, nice. That's not fair. Very nice. I need to make my counter harder. I think that's fair. Yeah, I need to make him Listen, harder. He 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 no, did a lot of damage to me before. I, all right, well he's gonna turn to face the ghoul because ghouls are not fun. Yeah, kill it. Not with that damage, I'm not. <laughs> Orc nineteen. <laughs> Give him some saves, Dicks. Success. That halved. What? Numbers. Come on. Hey, it just barely died. Okay, it just it barely, barely died. Barely, fairly. Well, you know what? Crossbow this bitch. Here. Mm. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's brutal, dude. Oh wait, wait, wait. I can. It didn't uh, roll. If we hit you, I can do that it, intercept. It didn't roll. Why not? Wait. I said a light crossbow. It, Did it's you not. Target what? Me? It's not rolling. What so the hell? Obviously, no. he, he can't. No, we're going to do crossbow this. Here, I'll do it on the token. There we go. Oh, come on. <laughs> ah. No. That is not cool. It. I <laughs> can man, it's just like a slow boat to China. Iser. <laughs> Damn. Um. Ow. I turn to face the two ghouls and activate my Tinkerbell <laughs> maneuver. Yes. You do what? I am now Tinkerbell maneuver. Tinkerbell. You're skyrocketing your Viking maneuver straight up in the air. No, I'm not going to go straight up. I I do have this explosion of my gold glittery radiant energy is suddenly commingling with uh vix's little ice fairies with their little sharp teeth so they're they're so, extra sparkly so now they're right even now they're sparkly me. yeah um cute and vix let me and see and then i'm gonna stand my ground because i don't want these guys going anywhere and that's thank you vix draw your take your circle out right one more little divot your 15 footer that, that puts me yeah. at 20. is that it's, right 
No, but it's so. Uh, but you're in the center. It's three squares on the other, every side. Okay, you're in the yeah, center, and that's why it's confused. measuring twenty because you're in the center okay. of the square. But that's what it should I was be. Like I don't know hey. how. No, that's work. that's why I like that. That that's perfectly fine. It's, it's three on our side because that shows that it gets them too. And that's what I was trying to make okay. sure. Does it does it get cool thirty two as well? Yeah, is if he's in, yeah, he's in colored. Okay. So yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, so Ghoul 15, where is he at? Uh, okay, so it's these guys over here. Well, they are able to, and they can make an athletics check because they can climb after you. Oh, crap. Kick him, in the yep. Kick him in the face, knock him down. I'm just kidding. Yep. Yeah. All right. Uh. Yep. He's able to get up there and claw at Moss. That's what you get. Uh, Ghoul Seventeen. Does he fall? Does he fall? Tell me he falls. He should fall with an ass. He. I'll make him make his dex check again. He fell off. Yes, he fell down ten feet and takes. I can't believe I just did that. Really? And takes <laughs> really nine points of falling damage, you idiot. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Did 17 sure, pass or fail? If I don't make it, make them, you know, if you don't make the ladies happy, you know how it goes. It's is, just, you know, is, you know. If I were to attack him when he's, is he like laying flat on the ground? He's for the moment, he's prone on the ground. Yes. So if he's prone, do I get like advantage? You or get something? advantage. Yeah. Oh, well, okay. shooting him, you don't. Range. Actually, shooting yeah, him, you shooting, don't. No. Range, shooting you don't. Disadvantage. Yeah, it's disadvantage on a prone. So if I jump down with a sword and like nail yes. him with it, does that yep. count? Yes. With advantage? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I will put prone on him. So just so you have it for the moment. Okay, what when are we doing? School seventeen. I, I thought did he get a save? Yes. Uh, not yet. I'm oh, waiting on. Does, I'm waiting. Yeah, I'm waiting on Vix. He got a save. Yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, okay. that that's not great damage. Yeah. Bad there. damage. <laughs> Naughty damage. Bam! Oh. Frickin' frick. Success. Yeah, but that's on your check. Damn it! All right. All right, 32, Vix. Failure. Yes. Nice. Big numbers. Right. Oh. One big These number. These numbers, come on. Damn it. Rule four. Five, ten, let's see. Is that uh, going to try climbing as well? Yep. They're hungry. Fuck. Let's see how Roll successful one. or Roll one. not successful. Roll one. He's Got up. It. That's not good. Hit. Oh, I mean. Oh. <sighs> come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes! Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> you failed. Oh, no. Let's say, Moss, do you want somebody? She is out of inspiration. Uh, she can clear. We have that. I was going to say floating one. Go ahead. We yeah. Can. yeah, I that need one. to know. I'm just saying, no, she's out of inspiration at the moment. Yeah. So what's that mean? Go ahead, boss. You can reroll. Okay, so I make her reroll it. Okay. You use that last one. I've got it. Okay, here we go. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh, oh, she's safe. All right. Thank you. <laughs> To be clear, is jumping yeah. off a building disengaging? <laughs> Does that count? No. <laughs> oh, killed I mean, an orc. Oh, wow. All righty. So the ghoul over here kills this orc and is like munching on him. All right, right, right. Nom, 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 nom. Like orcs back on the menu. All right. <laughs> All righty. Top of the order. Maslani, what do you want to do? Uh, okay. Yes. So. Di Maslani got inspiration. Is, okay, you got a point of inspiration, Moss. Oh, thank you. Oh my god, I don't know who sent that. Who sent that to me? Whoever it's Keltabor. I love you. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Keltabor. You're wonderful. Okay, 
So, is jumping off the building onto the other guy disengaging from the other dude? So you disengage as your bonus action. You jump, swatting the hands away from the one that's up there with you to land on the ground on the other. Yeah, below. Correct. And yes. I'm going to just have my short sword out and jump that's straight fine. down and right yep. in. Okay. Nice. So let's see how this goes. All right. And 15 is one land on the ground one. still. So, ba-doop. Okay, I targeted him. And I'm just going just to attack you. You, know, you just attack it. It'll give you the advantage roll because Rone's on him already. Well, it should. Nope, but did you got to target it? him. I just, yeah, I, should I did. No, I she did. clicked off of it. You had it and you clicked off of it. Oh, so shoot. Just roll the attack okay. again. Roll, just roll the attack. Let's just because it would be to okay. see if you get a 20. Just roll the attack. You got a hit already. Don't just target you know. him again. Yeah, just don't just roll the attack roll one more time. Okay. I just want to see if it. Oh. Wow. I'm glad I got that first one. Damn. <laughs> <sighs> All right. Okay. So now, so should now I target give, him. To now do target him. Control click on him. Yes. Yeah. And now you and can give him the damage. Don't forget your uh, sneak attack. Yeah. Correct. So. You sneaky, sneaky, too. Me, 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 me. I like my sneak attack. <laughs> me, me, me. Me, me, me. Because technically, yeah. she'd be alone oh. with the ghoul at this point. I know, Mrs. Smarty Pants. Okay. You know what? You need to come Let's back on camera. Ah. <laughs> Stuff that is not oh. kind. Killed him. Bam. Yeah. Okay. I just, just imagine Moss jumping off the building going, get off of me. <laughs> and just stick him with the sword in okay. his head. Because okay. why not? All right. Um, what else? So technically, I don't have to. I could just move then, because he's on the. You've got. You went ten building. feet down. Right. So. You got twenty feet left. All right. Two. Two. Hmm. You know what? One, two, three. Can I begin to climb? Because I could go fifteen feet that way. Can I start climbing up the wall and like stand in a windowsill or something? You're in. It, you're, you're not getting feet. away from him. So he's I he's got thirty feet of movement too. So, yeah. The brown building. I thought that wasn't a building anymore. Like it was. No, the, down. it's this. It's the black mess to the north here. This I thought was a building oh, until okay. I revealed it all, and it's not. It's just a black okay. mess. Okay. Well, yeah. <clears throat> I guess. Uh... There you go. I'll make that twenty feet like that. Yeah, he he's gonna he can get to you. So. I there's no way he's not going to be able to. So why not? That works for me. I mean, where else am I gonna go? Oh yeah, are you yeah. So anyway, skeleton. All right. Um, one, two, three. You know it was gonna be a mess. You just knew it. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Six. Do they have to make a save when they enter into That's the right. Yeah, when they, uh, I'm, that's what I'm yep. saying. They, yeah, he, she needs to give him a save because it came toward y'all. Yep. Why is that? Hello? What the hell was that? You just clicked on the yeah. Yeah. Failed. Give him some damage. Good damage, good damage. See, that works so much better. You have to say ka chow every time you hold it. Alright, I I, I, yeah. I I found the <laughs> the good the spot. magic words. <laughs> chow. Is that does Lightning McQueen say that or is it is it kachow or kaching? Kaching. I think it's kachow. I think it's kachow. I think you're right, yeah. Ka-chow. I could just picture Can only get copyright for that. that. <laughs> get in trouble. Nah. Nah. Twenty-three. There. Six. Success. Yeah. Nice damage. Why is it not targeting her? 
What in the hell is going on? It's probably because I have the thing on. Like, it's probably making it hard because I have the Oh, no, no. Where did you go? Put you back on yeah, the map. Yeah, I think we had this problem from... before. What in the blessed is going on? If I just move that. I don't that. about it. I don't think. It is. Wow. Uh, that's new. Okay. Well, I'll just, I can use the token on the, I mean, your avatar. Uh, still got a hit though. <laughs> oh, wait. Um. The, my uh, reaction to intercept the to the attack, I can do that. Well, it'll just it's gonna take some of the damage off. What are you doing? Okay, so fighter style interception. Uh, when a creature I can see hits a target other than me within five feet okay. yep. of you with yep. an attack, you can use your reaction to reduce damage by one d10 plus proficiency. So. Okay, just so that should be a heal, her. then it shouldn't it? Um, yep. Yep. Yeah, just put it on, but back on her hand. Yeah. There you go. Done. Okay, nice. Five points back. Yep. Okay. And let's see. What do we got here? 24. They're over here just bitch slapping this orc around. Um, missing. Nice. Apparently not, though. This guy's just going to move up here and shoot the orc. No, apparently not. Vix. Okay. I'm going to... Sorry. I'm going to figure something out really quick. What's wrong? Uh, where's my, how do I get my thing? Oh no! <laughs> uh, it's a big circle. It's a big one. Can I move? Can, it, can you like just move me there? I'm not actually moving there, but I just want to see something. The, the thing would not. Hmm. So if it's a 30 foot radius. Of what? Cause I wanna it's I wanna do turn undead. You need to go He's six dead. squares out from where you're six centered. squares out from everybody. Yeah. So one more square. Okay. She's on yeah, she's so right on no, it. No, she's, she, she's there. She was right. Yeah, back it up one. Best back it up a little bit. Normally what I do is I draw what I draw I draw the circle at an at an intersection point. Like that. And then right? and then move it back on top of you and you'll be you'll be dead on. So Okay, so if I turn undead, I would get everyone except for like Ghoul Seven and Skeleton for Twenty Four, and obviously the one that's that Moss was dealing yep. with. Yep. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna take the off shot from Skeleton Twenty Three. Okay, so you're dropping Guardians. Uh, no, I don't think I, I have to. It's concentration. Yeah, but turn it is it, I don't think that's a concentration. Oh. That's a good question. It's not, is it? Is it? I'm thinking it was. No, I don't think no, I No, it's just an action. Yeah. Now. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Yep. Okay, so I'm going to I'm going to keep my my spear guardians up, but then I'm going to turn undead. Okay. Uh so that would be that one, that one. That one. Oh wait, not the orc. Yeah, orc, yeah. No nork. Not the orc. No nork. No Nork. Shut up, Josh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I love it. The backseat DM over there. It's beautiful. No, it's not. Not beautiful at all. But we what? like Josh. No, we don't. He's trying to help. Okay. So us. Do the the skeletons that failed. Are they destroyed? They are CR. Uh, I would think they are. They're CR quarter. So yeah, oh, I'm, yeah. I'm eight, so so, which you should have an a, you should have the effect that you could uh, put on them, and then that'll tell me who got popped. Well, it like so who? It, it, yeah, because you only have so so it, it shows seventeen, twenty seven, and thirty two are the ones that got turned. Everybody else saved. So ghoul, the ghouls are <laughs> CR one. So what's your undead high level? Is it a quarter or an eight? I can't remember. Oh, I have no idea. Here, let me just look. Destruct. 
Turn undead. You would think it would say it in the description, but it doesn't. Um, well, you have to have the. So do you have that yet? It don't they don't blow up unless you? Yeah, no, I'm 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 level eight. Yeah, I was gonna say that should. Where the hell is it? Yeah, it, it doesn't say it on there for whatever reason. It's kind of stupid. You might have to look under the abilities tab and read the whole thing. Uh, I can't remember. Destroy undead CR one. They are one. Okay, so yeah. that gets. Okay, well then that gets some. Um, that gets. Uh, what do we say? Your your deal showing. School Level seventeen. Twenty seven and thirty two. School thirty two. And skeleton. Good job. Skeleton. What? What? Twenty seven. Yeah, and then that would be my spirit guardians okay. back. Yep. So I have these Leave three. Leave some in for my... me, Vix. <laughs> There's one. There's right a couple more up there if you want to go take care of them. I mean, I got all glowy. Yes, you could fly over there. Yeah, you could take out that uh, number, whatever one is by me. Four. Number four. <laughs> number four. Do they even know that you're uh, de dealing with them right now? I don't think so. I mean, they would be distracted answered. by what's going on in front of them, but... That's right. I mean, you would think my party would be like, wow, where'd Moscow? <laughs> they don't ever worry about well, you. Well, you're a ninja, so we don't know yeah, Exactly. Going. Yeah, you're on the other side um, of the building. They have no idea. They could see... Vix could see me. But maybe she could, busy. maybe she shouldn't. I saw, you, make... I saw you when you hopped up on the building. She didn't make a perception check when she was casting, so... Oh, she passed her turn. Oh, it's okay. Right. Yeah, I don't Sorry. think so. Oh, it's going to move just a little bit. Stop. She's going to move on the other side of Isra. <laughs> and we'll throw... When I can pick on Lori, I try my best. Okay. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> yeah. I got to have, like, a great attack earlier. I'm happy. Yeah. Eleven. That would be a death, I think, of a skeleton. Cool. Hey. Cool. Orc two. Starts his turn in there. Any day now, Vix. Any day now. She's got to scroll I'm through a lot of stuff. Not paying attention right now. Leave me alone. Oh. <laughs> I'm paying attention. You give me too yeah. much credit. <laughs> Nice. Bammy. Okay. Death. Or four is not looking good here. He is upset. I mean, he's perfectly. Oh, he's a little wounded, but he's got, you know, yeah. four people to play with. Isra. He doesn't have multi attack, nothing? No, they don't. They just have the aggressive uh, feature. Uh, DM, standard can, I, can I roll a perception to see if I yes. see that? Yes. Okay. Yes. Can I? No. Nine. Okay, cool. Nine. Nine. Did you, did you, might, you probably have a whole bunch of inspiration if you want to burn one. Nine. That's true. That's true. Wait, wait, wait. I will use an inspiration. Oh, come on. Thank you, Moss, for reminding me. Let her burn it this way. I don't know how to sneak attack, attack, but I do know how to use inspiration. Oh, not even nine, 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 nine. Nope. nine, nine. nope. Good burn. Okay. That's okay. I have a plan. I have a plan. Okay. I have a really you don't see good her. Plan. Okay, cool. I, uh, came in and, oh, my freaking frick. Oh, I still hit. Okay, cool. I'll take Skeleton. it. Skeleton. <laughs> oh, Lord. And hit it. Oh, jeez. Tickle, tickle, tickle. <sighs> okay, so that was. Oh, but you got it. Yeah, she five. killed it. Did I move five feet or ten feet? <laughs> I did. Five. She was right five? I don't remember. Oh. She was right above. She moved 30. Uh, she moved sorry. 30. Five, <laughs> 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Cool. I'm going to go the rest of my movement to here. Then I will cast, use my bonus action to Misty Step. Five. 
5, 10, 15. 20. 20. Where do I want to be? So all of these guys are like on top of this orc, right? Yeah, yeah right at the moment, yes. Okay, so I'm going to miss you step right here and use my second swing on this guy. Okay. And I should get advantage, right? You're behind him. Yep. Beautiful. But you don't get sneak attack. <laughs> Man, I love being Isra. Isra is the shit against the undead. Boom. Boom. Oof, Done. Four. Well, poop. Yes or no? Yes or no? What? You that was a fail. You're on your. You, she does. She has a point of inspiration. Do you want to use it or not? Uh, sure. <laughs> Maslani is paralyzed from the claw attack as she drops oh, to the ground. And the ghoul has used his movement, but it is grabbing her by the legs to drag her off. Oh, shit. Ghoul seven. Oh, um, no. Let's see. Is ghoul seven smart? Ghoul seven sees fresher meat. It's not orky. Steps over here. Not orky. Hitting. That armor, man. That armor. What's this? Maslani. Uh, all right, let's see. Oh, yeah. You well, get... I can. can I healing uh, word myself? The, or? No, the, well, you're paralyzed right now. You can't do anything. However, you, get a, you may make a constitution saving throw. But it, uh, saying is the something end of, isn't an action. You're paralyzed. You're paralyzed. Okay. Unfortunately, from I'm the ghouls. I'm not had to roll a save, so I just roll the under you just, saves. I just roll that one. You just roll a Constitution saving throw on the front of your character sheet on the right. Yeah, roll the save, con save, and okay. Oh, so nice. You're nice. not paralyzed anymore, but that was the, that's all you can do on your turn, though. So, shit is, yep. But you are not paralyzed. I can't so like it, yell for help or anything. No, that's the end of your turn. Yep, that is the only thing you're allowed to do. Okay. You are you are prone though, so. All right, skeleton fifteen will continue to attack the orc. Oh, well, won't skeleton twenty four. Hey, Vix, maybe you should roll a perception check next round. <laughs> <laughs> I'm planning on it. <laughs> or I don't know, or Isra, or Sorrow, or anybody. <laughs> I, just, so can I, can I, make a, check? I I don't think I you can make a perception can check. Sorrow can't way. see it because of the house, but yeah, Sorrow can yeah. see because yeah. of the house. Yeah. But you can always tell Sorrow about it. You may see the ghoul hey, trying to drag Maslani off. Uh, I'm gonna yell back to Sorrow. Go get Maslani. She's over by the buildings. Okay. Got it, boss. And then I'm gonna scoot my way over here. Face the third. Yeah. Hey. Nice. Uh, <laughs> and then I'm going to cast. Uh, da, 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 da. I'm going to cast. Oh my god, where is it? I'm going to cast Sacred Flame on the ghoul. Oh, it failed. Yeah, okay. Uh, and that's going to be it for me. Sorrow. All right. Pew, so Sorrow's going to kind of beeline it to where. Uh, would you really go do her. that, though, Sorrow? Or do you, would you, you chart your own course and path in life? Shut up, Zip Duff. It, Duff. <laughs> <laughs> I gave her a lockpick set at some point to borrow. She's looking she for her like, friend. Yeah. You know what? This isn't your friend. Yeah, that's, you need that's to... true. But look for your friend. if I get rid of these people first, then I don't have to worry about it later. 
Or I have the bag of holding and, you know, if I get killed, she can just take it off of me. You know, that's that's a thing, too. There's also that. Hey, I have Bernie Fran. Hands. She wants Fran. <sighs> QB. I need to roll QB. You're... Shut your mouth. QB is oh fine. Oh, my God. Where's QB's NPC? <laughs> QB I'm rolling QB fine. right now. Don't. QB is, is escaping from the chest. Bullshit. He is not. He is in the chest. He is I fine. am he is so happy. rolling he... this up right now. Oh, I hate you okay. so much. Well, right hold now. on. Let me finish uh, all my attacks right now. <laughs> do you understand? I care more about that cube than I do my character. Do you understand I know. this? I know you do. I know you do. That's why I was like, oh, I gotta get. Where is QB? Damn it! I've lost my. I gotta QB find him. I closed. I closed the module for him. I'm gonna open it back up. We'll just roll a D20. If it's a ten or less, he's gonna escape. All right, I, I did my I, I did my good deed. You killed him, yeah. All right, I killed him. I burned him. Oh, thank God! Lots of burning. Wait, where'd he go? Wait, <sighs> oh. or four? And possibly thank I you? might have caught the building on fire. Yeah, true. That's okay. That's true. Just drag my ass away from it. It'll be fine. Well, you're not paralyzed. You totally crawl on your own. We're totally going to have to, like, book it out of this area. <laughs> hey, at I least know. I didn't do the Thunder Wave, okay? That That's was right, my other yeah. option. Bam. Take some radiant damage! At least I didn't burn the building that the commoners were in. That's also a good point. Oof. Also, also good. Very <laughs> proud. Okay, at the Very end of the proud. day, though, we probably should pull all the orc bodies and whatnot into a b building, burn it, so that way when the next people, the next orcs come around, they don't notice. That there's or a you just leave them with the ghouls and the skeletons and nobody's I mean, going to know. Yeah, there, there's a oh, bunch that's of true. ghouls, the ghouls and, skeletons. and skeletons. They killed each other. Okay. We still that's need to get out As far here. as they know. Um, I mean, I, yeah. I don't know how, how well forensic science has progressed in this era. <laughs> I'm going to go with not that well. My slimy. <laughs> so what up. do I do at this point? I, I know. What am I Get rolling? up off the ground. Oh, oh, I, I can move around now. Yeah, yeah. You're not paralyzed anymore. You made the save. You you shoved it off, but just, okay. that was all you could do for that turn. I'm, so I would like to healing word myself. Can I do that? Yeah, yeah. To myself. Absolutely. Okay, so. How do we do spells? Do I just pull that little plus onto my character? Or what you, do I get? Yeah, you open up the magnifying glass next to a spell, and there's a heal in there. And you grab Oopsie. and grab. I didn't mean well, to you do that. grab Sorry. that six. No, that's fine. That's what it is. Grab the six and drop it on you, though. Grab it on and drop it on your token, or or in the combat tracker, the six down in the chat window. You healed yourself for six that? points. Now the spell sure slots up off. above. Yeah. Go check one of them off because you've used a spell slot. For her first level spell. spell. It's, she says all she's got at the very top, right below your oh, weapons okay. on your yeah, on your oh, actions tab. Okay. There you go. You've used Sweet. a spell. You, you cast your first spell. Nicely done. <gasps> I'm so proud. Little baby um, spell caster. And let's then give I her, let's give her a cheer. Okay, you know so. <laughs> And okay. then I lo I just cut off a, um, excuse me cut off a chunk of the ghoul who almost killed me and he pissed me off I cut off a good tasty looking chunk and shove it in QB's box. QB you I see QB it. and he goes mm. he spits it out. Ooh he doesn't <laughs> like rotten. ghoul. He doesn't like ghoul. Picky little shit. <laughs> doesn't like ghoul. Uh, doesn't like orc. You got him. You got him. He's got calamari sushi. Is what you got him hooked on. So, I was gonna say, you oh, like wow. that eel. come on, Damn mom. It. Okay, I'm sure get that with eel the program. Is all sorts of. Okay, oh, actually, had to you make know the what? gelatinous I... cube. Hang on. Bougie. I have a ton of salt, <laughs> and I had all that eel. So, did I salt the eel? No. To preserve it to feed to him later. I like my salt, Doc. Just saying. I know you like your salt. I, I, yeah, I, would, like, uh -huh. I would think salt would be bad against a cube because it's kind of gelatinous slime and the slimes. And, and he oh, he's well, carted no, around saying, it. I would have salted it. She tried to put a circle but, around him, and he broke out of it. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. He's built okay. up yeah. an immunity. Salty. He's a salty boy. I, I grab, mm -hmm. I grab some ration cube. and give it to him. Will he eat rations? 
Really? God. Little shit. Okay, well then fine. If you don't want what I made He's, for you, and you're you're noticing not that his, his his container is now too small for him. He's a little upset with you, okay? And yeah, I know he's he needs to get out and roam around a little bit. He needs some free space, mom. Okay. Uh, he's a I free need a I'm being a soccer a mom. Okay. Uh, helicopter uh, mom. It's helicopter, helicopter mom. Helicopter mom. Okay. Anything uh, else, Moss? What else are you going to do? Nah. Uh, nothing. Eh, I'll head. Uh, hey, thanks for saving me. And then I'm going to walk over this way to get closer to the girls. And I pass okay. my turn. All right. Oops. Saves. I'm assuming this should take him out. Damn, there's the first one. I'm going to say he is dead. Oh, look at that damage. Beautiful damage. Like, that's what I'm talking about. Good job. Yeah, we need more sevens. <laughs> okay. The last skeleton goes down and it comes quiet. So you, maybe the ruckus alerted. You don't know. We need to move. We need to get the slaves. We need to. Where are you going? We need to get the hell out of here. Uh, we're gonna uh, go back I, and get the slaves. Yeah. We we go right. and collect you, collect our. You walk our into people. the building where you left them. Oh, oh stop shit! It. They're right Duh. where we, we left them. Don't do that. They're gone. They're gone. Don't do that. There's a bloody trail. <sighs> A bloody trail. You, the room is bloodied up where you Every left time. them again by themselves. Every time. And they got eaten alive. No, they didn't. Oh, well, shit. They're all dead? No, they're right there. No, no I'm joking. <laughs> oh. oh, well, wait. Well, because, Lori, well, Lori, were you... Did, did we explain to you what happened with the others? Were you in that game when we explained I, what happened to the other slaves? Did you... Did I... Were you... I the doppelganger there. killed them all? Were you in that... Did you miss that? No, I, I think, think I missed that one. Okay, so yeah, so it was re so the reveal was that there's a was there's several there's doppelgangers and were part of the structure Every down there year. below. Yeah, and one of them was a slave that was the slave girl that y'all found in the loft above the orcs. Oh, y'all yeah, rescued yeah, and, yes. and then y'all put that doppelganger in the room with the slaves and left them there, and it it ate uh, them all, ate those slaves, uh, and, and then it got revealed because the doppelganger right. was in the main other slave group. That's that was yeah. So that's what we're joking about. Okay. I got. It. Um, so anyway, so Sar comes back over here too. Or Sar, you go off on your own. I don't know what you're doing. No, uh, no. I... Okay. So yes, you uh, get the commoners and you skedaddle. Yeah. Through the ruins, back to the deal, and we're going to a kabami. All righty. So where are we okay. now, roughly? Uh, where the, so the by the nine? Yeah, uh, you got yeah, you'd get you no, get we, over we the, road. the road. Yeah, you yeah. get you went across the we road. So the yeah, road. yeah, you're in this you're in the center area of nine. Let's say. Okay. Yeah. Can we can we find uh, a good place to hole up? Mm hmm. Take a short rest at least. Yeah, just not not in this area. Maybe like further. Like we'll we'll keep going for like another. Yes. Away couple from hours to find a place. Yeah. Well, you sneak through and you can get you get closer to the next major road. And you're well, now like understanding that. At least. Yeah, you're trying to get to there, or you can cut. You've got a watchtower that's over there that you can see is patrolled. Uh, and once you get, you know, continue going closer and closer toward the Bay Area, that's more populated areas, and it's m more things are put back in order. Uh, the checker, the lined area is more goblinish territory. The light gray areas are orcish. So you're coming, you know, but you know you've got well, to get to one, so, which is... We know we could probably go into the goblin area because, like, Moss isn't good with them. I'm in good with the goblins. Some of the goblins. There's different tribes. They, well, but. and they might not be happy now that the orcs have. Orcs have. Well, you don't know what's happened with them. The revolution. Yeah, Viva la Revolution cost the goblins, you think. Up to y'all. 
Maybe it was uh, you can find a place to rest. You can find a place to rest yeah. the, it, the the rest of the night. That is yeah. easy easily done. Yeah. Could we go so into we get the a long human rest. district and do that? If you want to try, if you want to expose the slaves, to more eyes. Oh, there's that. Mm. Well, it's nighttime though. Nighttime now. Yeah, I was gonna say, could we like hole up in a place? Um. Like, go up into, like, the human district that's, like, right above, like, hold on. Not there. To the, not eight, but the one south below the watchtower. Hold on, Duff. This one. That's, that's orcish. That's, yeah. Right here. Yeah, it's light gray. Gray's orc. Light gray's oh, orcs. got it, got it, got it, got it. What feel if we, like, like oh. what if we go to one of the orc one of the human so what if we go to here oh my god the freaking pointer what if we go to here and hold them up for the night somewhere and then what like we could go out like two of us could go out and get like regular clothes for them to wear to make it easier for us to cart them through the city Isra, make me a insight check that's never good. Nope. I'll inspiration. Okay. I will use my last inspiration. Come on. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Hey, Doug, uh, you know that crit I got earlier? Can I crit on a skill check? <laughs> I'm, I'm laughing because we've, it's been a few, it's been, so uh, Isra, what's over here? My, temple, temple. Where my, my friend with the temple is. Your friend's uh -huh. temple. Yes. That's number eight. Hey guys. So I have this friend. Y'all met with him because he helped get y'all through. He was trying to help yeah, get y'all through the checkpoint. You remember my, uh, my evil cleric friend? Uh, well, you know his 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 temple's just like right up there. That's we should, we should, safe that place, then. any? And what we That's, what was uh, his name? Um, I, I'm I'm trying to no, look at my notes. Nabuk. No book. No no book. Yeah, no book. No book. No book. No book. Uh, here, bring my notes up. Oh my god, where the hell are my notes, man? Don't worry. I hid them. The notes. The book. Don't worry. She's got them. I got notes. You gonna go see Nabuk? Yeah, I don't know. Yep. sure. Talk to Isra. Cleric of Grunosh. Grumosh. Yeah, well, he. Yeah, that's what the. So the temple was what what he really is. It was, but it's been destroyed more in favor of the uh, Earth Elementals and the uh, yeah. Cult of the Dragon. So, okay, you go to Nabuk. Is Nabuk home? Let's see. Or does the book head on a pike outside the door of the temple oh, hopefully for his not traitorous actions? No, the book's home. The book survived. Awesome. Uh, yeah, we just walk right into the temple, start directing people. <laughs> sit, sit there, sit there. The book. Hey. Yeah, he comes. Yeah, he hears the commotion and all that, and comes out. You know, and is like, "You, you can't do this. You can't. This is temple." You understand the trouble that you'll put me in? What is going on here? Where did all these people come uh, from? Well, this this is part of. Can I know, sacrifice one my... of them? No. <laughs> you would pony up the boy. No, wait. Where's the little up the boy? Moss. I I was just like, no. What about what are you supposed to do? What are you doing with all these pe slaves? <gasps> you stole the slaves. Are you becoming slavers? Are you starting your own business? No. Did you have candy? In a book. <laughs> you wanted you wanted us to sow some discord and chaos and try and shake these earth cultists. Yeah. Not in my Wait, temple. Flavors. It's only for 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 one one night. We'll be gone. You made your persuasion check. <laughs> Do you have any like gob that we could put on them? Good what? Gob. Clothes. Clothes. 
boys. Does anybody wow. want to share an inspiration point with me? I am all out. Uh, may I? I, may I, I give dice color. <laughs> may I give Isra a uh, uh, like? May I provide the help action to Isra since I am proficient in persuasion checks? Go just make sure you roll an advantage. Yeah. Yeah. So roll again, Isra, just straight up, and then that. Yeah, apparently, Vix feels helpful. It's not every day. Better. <laughs> Much better. <laughs> okay, yeah. So he's he's very upset and nervous. Uh, he yeah. So he and he relates to you know yeah. you understand you know you kind of where did they all come from? He's made the uh, you know correlation that you've removed him from the slavers compound, and then you know he goes into you know, he goes you know shuts the doors, and tries to you know close up windows and all that, and tries to douse you know douse as much as the lights, keep them quiet. Uh, you know, but you, yeah, you don't have much time because there are, we'll tell you that the orc patrols have become <coughs> more numerous and more forceful in their ways here now, uh, especially mm-hmm. along the more populated parts of Highport. Uh, the Viva la Revolution uh, is yeah, torn the Highport apart, but the goblins and snivel nose, snot nose ring. What did we call him? Um, gibber, uh, gibber, gibber, nose. gibber nose, gibber nose, gibber nose. Gibber nose. Like he, uh, he's dead. Oh, what? Oh no. We, we were supposed to gibber mind. nose. The gibber nose, gibber nose was the leader of this revolution. And oh, no. the gob, those goblin clans were wiped out. And oh. the orcs have clamped down on high port and they're, not you know taking shit from anybody and they're checking everybody's you know credentials more <coughs> and making sure you know if you have business here or if not they're killing people on the spot it is bad news okay but what are you going to do with them you got a day before sooner or later another orc will come through here uh, well, we need clothing for them and to burn these slave smocks. Where am so I supposed to get clothing from? Don't you have like ro- robes for your little uh, wait? Um, person? Are there really like not? Are there got... like curtainy type things around? No, this like... was a destroyed temple. It's a make shell. It's a you know what's left of a Hold temple on. that's been painted up and put, you know. Hold one moment. How many slaves do we have? Twenty. Mm-hmm. Twenty. Hold one minute. Um, I have one set of common clothes. I have. Hold on. Hold on. You don't Somewhere. have enough there, Moss. I hang on. I have things. You're gonna try I to have... tell me you're gonna sew up a bunch of clothes. So I have I, I have I could two do a sets couple. of common clothes and one set of travelers clothes. So that's three for me. I have, I have one a set of common four. and a set of travelers. So that's two for so that's me. Five. Yeah, he says. Unfortunately, uh, um, any of the clothes that he has, they're bloodied up really bad. They've got holes in them. So Moss, how many how many clothes do you have in total? I have one, but I also have, I can't find it. I have, oh, I've, uh. Is there anything in Fran? Clothing wise? I have the robes from, remember I kept stealing robes back in the day? I'm trying to find them. Oh, from, from like our first. Yes. Area, those yeah. people. Yeah. Yes. They're somewhere in here. Okay. So how many sets of clothes did we have? We had three, four, five, six between the three of us. Mm-hmm. And I could probably uh, cut those into smaller things and double that because I'm a seamstress. That's twelve outfits. And on the books, then you're not actually going to try to walk them through town, are you? What if you're stopped? We're still going to be stealthy, but we're going to be less noticeable if they're not in smocks. Yes, okay. I could probably make a dozen outfits out of what we have. It would be my guess. I mean, that's up to you. I... Also, I have a blanket. You could prob I could probably <sighs> MacGyver a blanket into some kind of clothing as this well. This is Lori's type saying, of game and folks, what we're getting I'm here just right saying, now. Dumb. Okay. Did you not read my backstory? I am a seamstress. Oh, I know you're a seamstress. I you know, but doing this, you know, in the middle of the night, you know, it may take uh, you a few okay. days need, to do that. I need a whole bunch of coffee. 
Oh my god. I am going to take one set of the traveler's clothes and kind of like At least we like could dress them. a couple. I'm gonna lay them on the ground and kind of like place them out and then I'm gonna take my paints and I'm gonna start kind of <gasps> matching up You're and so painting smart. out of this. More clothes for them. That's very clever. That's very so clever. Smart. I'm gonna go oh in between god. me Will it do and that? Does you the paints do anything like that? I forgot. I'll... Yeah. If it makes a door, I mean, why would it not they make become it's not, They're not worth more than 25 gold. Oh <laughs> my god. I've seen it all now. Where the hell are those paints? I keep losing them. I know. I can't. Components drawing the cono. They're not in your. I don't know where they went. I think I think when we switched over or something happened. I don't know. That was um, dungeon master guide, magic items. Pigments. It lets me create inanimate objects. Um, it takes like, me damn, 100 minutes, module. 10 minutes to cover 100 feet, 100 square feet. Um, Here they are. Nothing created by the pigments can have a value greater than 25 gold pieces. Huh. Oh, it's called, oh, they're not, oh, it's fine wooden box. It's not, <laughs> hold on. You got too many here. All right, fine wood. No, 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 I had three. Right? No. Three oh no, I, I had three. Had... I had three pots. Yeah, three pots three inside. Pots. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah. 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 but here they are. They what? It's for some reason they weren't identified. That's why you were losing them. There they are. That's annoying. Yeah, I identified um, them. Yeah, so I can paint any inanimate object as long as it's not like more than twenty-five gold pieces, which I imagine. Sets of travelers' clothes is not more than twenty-five gold. Two goals. Oh hell no, they're nothing. Common clothes are even cheaper. Oh yeah, I'll, I'll paint some common clothes then because I have I have a. So we have six, so I'll paint fourteen, and I'll I'll kind of just do that. Da -da -da -da. Na -na 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 -na. Okay. And for the record, I don't have the robes. I remember I threw them over the head of something we were fighting at some point to blind it, and it didn't work. And then I never went back and got them. Okay. We were fighting those dinosaur things. Yes. Isra. I pull out my fake papers that he had gotten for us. So can you get any more of these? What for all them? Mm hmm You don't need them. Isra. Oh no? I thought that they were like the patrols were like checking. <laughs> oh, well, said. okay, yeah, they might. Uh but those were to get you to go to the slaver compound. Those were right, to get you past we... there. So that you're not going that way. I mean, he, he doesn't know that. So, um, they, you would have, he, they would say then the, the clothes and the stuff you had, I mean, you're not going to pass for slavers. With that group. He could what do you want the papers to say? Because that all that was was to try to get y'all past the guard units there that you had business up at the slaver compound. Why do we have twenty people walking through Highport, y'all? Yeah, what's the what is the uh, purpose? What are they doing? They are. Uh. Uh. Maybe we are spreading ship crew. The word. Ship crew. Oh, beautiful. Yep. On leave. Getting back to the. Yeah. Getting back. Getting back to whatever that tavern was that was close enough to uh, where. Because you... um... the docks are up there, right? That that's where yeah. the docks are. Yeah, and the docks are along just north where y'all are at. Salsa quit. Damn it, cat. Salsa. So yeah, if we um, say we're we're just part of the ship crew and we're just kind of heading heading our, making our way back to the docks, we were kind of mm -hmm. held up by all of the uh, stuff going on in the city. Yeah, and we're making. We need our way to, back uh, to uh, as I'm as I'm painting the clothes, uh, Moss and Isra need to kind of like quiz the uh, the slaves on some like. Uh, if if anyone asks you, this is ship, what we're doing. Ship etiquette and things like that, yeah. and like 
how ships work and things like that, just kind of so they 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 if we're if they're asked about it, sure hey. they know. Okay, which side is the port? Port is the left side of the boat. That kind what's, of stuff. What's a port? <laughs> what's a port? It's not that phrase. stupid. They're humans. <laughs> yeah, they're not that dumb. I hope. Uh, in the book, would we would we need papers? To get back, or what? If we were a ship crew trying to get back to our ship, if you can get to the human or human areas and all that, then no. But you better what know if, what ship you're going to. What if we're not going to the human areas? Then you, uh, I wouldn't be taking the humans in that in that area then. Um, <sighs> maybe we take them into the human area. Now that we're right here, and one of us goes back, or two of us, two of us, go back to our friends and see how they want to... I could, I need if, a long rest, but I could just cast Sending. I just need a long rest because uh, perfect. I don't have it prepared. Okay, that's great. And I could contact the, either Makaro or Quan. Mm -mm. Names. Well, I'm mm -hmm. table talk. Okay. I'm not saying that out loud. Okay. <laughs> I'm not using the duh. accent. That means I, I'm not using the accent. That that means I'm not like talking out loud. Yeah, no, I'm not. I'm listening. I'm letting y'all <laughs> figure this out. I'm hearing y'all's talk. As we get closer to the end of the session here, what's going to happen? And y'all like get the idea. slaves to Makaro without killing them so all. We're going to take a long rest here, then we're going to go east into the human area, find a tavern or something to hole up in, and bribe <laughs> whoever we have to, to shut up about how many of us there are, and then in the morning Vix can do the sending? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm. So well, you're gonna you're gonna send to Makaro? Yeah, I can cast sending, so I can message him once we've made our way into the human area and let him know and say, "Here we are here. We have slaves. What do you want us to do?" Okay. Hey. Uh, so we're going, you're going into the human areas in the center of Highport, right? After a long rest. Yes. I have a long, yeah. yeah. I had already given the long rest. Mm -hmm. So yeah, you're good. Okay. All right. And you're trying to find a place, a public place where you've got people kind of hanging out, right? Yeah. Like a tavern or yeah. something. Yeah. You can find there's, there's. Oh, yeah. Small trade and shops and all that, you know, it's like I said, it's the humanoid, the human areas are definitely like, you know, we're more, more built up, more clean, you know, that's a subjective term in high port, but you know, um, if you've got, at least as long as you've got some coin, then yeah, okay, you We've can feed them, that. you know, you find a few spots, kind of put, you know, people together. And then you send to Makaro. And what do you tell Makaro one more time? Uh, so is there like a, is there a name of the establishment we're at? What do we want you to call it? You don't have to say a name. I, I just need to know. Yeah, just, yeah, uh, yeah. The, yeah. the Mossy the broken, Anchor? The Broken, the Broken Rock. <laughs> yeah, broken, I don't know. The Broken Rock. The Broken Ore. Or. like, it's Vix. We're at the Broken Prank phone call. Prank phone call. With... Like. Shut up. That's not how the spell works. With 20 slaves. 20? What do you want us to do next? Please respond Nothing. to this message. Nothing. Stay where you're at. Quan will come find you. Cool. Okay. Uh, Duff, how much do I need to bribe this tavern keeper? Maybe persuasion check. With advantage. Fix is going to help you. She got her oh, I thought you were sending. I, I was gonna. Well, 
now that we know that we're supposed to stay here, duh. Uh, okay, so I got Vix next to me. Boobs out. Boobs out. Boobs out. Oh, there you go. That's a roll. It didn't register. I know it didn't. Oh, I see it on my. No, I see the nineteen. It, there it goes. There it goes. It's lovely. It's always Drop at the end six. of the sessions. <laughs> Fancy ground starts. You know, timing out. Okay, you're good. Oh, okay. that was a. It, it's actually Duff. I actually rolled for perception. perception. It's, it's persuasion, plus seven, not plus one. Oh. Plus well, seven, I, I still want the right roll though. Really? No. Yeah, uh, <laughs> <you know. laughs> I would oh, die if she re like pulling her legs. Okay, yeah. So you, yeah. So a couple gold pieces, you know, not you know, um, you know, you like you said, you did what you did. So we'll say five gold. Do so I like some... this tavern keeper? Are they nice? It's high port, you know, not high brow, high port. So it is what it is. So, but. If you're paying, then you can stay. If you're not paying, get the F out. I hand over 10 gold. You'll get 10 more gold when we leave. We want quiet and we want baths and food. Well, you want a bath, go jump in the bay. I'm gonna... <laughs> I give him. They don't have a shit. They don't have. They got, a, they got an outhouse. They got no. They ain't got no. Bring got me no water. your laundry. Bring me your laundry barrel, and where is the nearest well? I'll start hauling water myself, and you heat it up. She's speaking strong. She wants to make sure everybody gets a bath, so they don't smell like slaves. Slaves, yeah. No, they smell like slaves. Okay. All right. Yep. You can clean them. So you're going through all yeah. that process, and as you're feeding, and you know, um, um. This guy's dumb. All right, so um, you can do all that, and when you're through a good bit of that process, Quan makes his way into the establishment to kind of first, you know, seeing all of y'all, and then, you know, looking. Wait a second, there were five of y'all. Who? Where's Where's the rude one? Where's Where's Jana? <laughs> Ice relieves the room. <laughs> oh. Too soon. We can't handle that conversation. <laughs> uh, Sorrow, who's never met this person. Yeah, yeah who are you? Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Oh, the 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 one that wears all the black. She she disappeared. Like it was like a regular Tuesday. Like no emotion involved whatsoever. And they look. It looks to y'all. Who is this one? Where did this uh, one? Where did this uh, one come from? Her. This is our little orphan child we took in. <laughs> you replace one orphan with the other. <laughs> yeah, we, we lost the other orphan and ended up with this <laughs> one over here. So. Can't be as bad as the other one then. <laughs> oh my god. Hashtag D&D backstories. <laughs> yeah, so you have to go back and watch the other, all the other shows to understand what the hell's going on here now. Okay. Right. Uh, I, I guess I'm not that bad. I mean, I'm somewhat house trained. I, I, I don't set things on fire anymore. She, she hasn't peed That's on the floor bonus. yet. I know she had peed, yeah, exactly, or thrown up or spit <laughs> on people. Okay, yeah, you, and yeah, you smell Pop better. Up the hairball, whatever. Okay, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, okay, yeah, and so he looks through that and he assesses <coughs> what's going on, what's happening. He gets kind of the lay of the land of what yo where they came from, and it kind of confirms that, um, uh, yeah. Uh, it's, there hasn't been some new cargo coming in. They haven't seen, you know, um, there's, they've got some slaves and stuff that have been left in, in a warehouse that they've been dealing with because something, the operations kind of just like overnight ceased for some reason. Um, and, um, we were that reason. maybe, yeah. And that's what he's putting the two and two together. And he's going to say, all right, get them clean. And he's gonna, he's gonna, get, he's got some wagons, a couple of wagons. He's going to try to wrestle up, um, to put rations and kind of supplies in. And we're going to take it. We're, it's going to be a task, but we're going to break them into smaller groups and run them toward west up the Sus Road, um, and 
get the slaves, you know, in the closer to the ruins there where the the uh, safe house is at. Um, take the supplies into the orc encampment there, as though that you know, trying to, you know, feed them and supply them up. And we'll run them back and forth that way and get the groups to the compound into the house. Then they can get them down into the sewer levels because they have now solidified. You know, they did the work with the you know the y'all cleared out the way. They've made good friends with the troglodytes that are down there. The troglodytes keep to their tail. We don't mess with their farm and their their tribe that is there. And and Dern still Dern still carting them back and forth, right? He's he's the one that's kind of taking them on the <clears throat> ship. And well, they um, they got him out. He was doing yeah yeah that's right yeah Dern was some of it, but they've had to they, they've kind of piled back up a little bit. He apparently Dern. Um, got on a bender one night and sailed off for a while. So apparently there was, apparently there was talk of another dead whale in the Bay area somewhere. He went went Ahab on him. So, okay. Another, another, another another coin showed up on the deck of the ship. Okay. (laughs) You throw a copper into the ocean. What one time? time. <laughs> one time. That's right. You littered one time. Perfect. Now he every now and then every sail along and a copper coin gets split up out of the ocean and lands on the deck. Okay? Just like, They're oh, watching. Okay? All the time. People are watching the show going, what the hell are they talking about? Gotta watch the passion. Moby that, dead. That Moby things, dead. Moby yes. dead. And littering in the ocean gets you in trouble with the dead. Okay? Especially a big undead whale. Okay. I was say with with the undead. Dog. Okay, yep. All right. So, uh, someone make me a couple of um, performance rolls, please. Performance. Performance. I have a plus uh, four. Moss, right? Well, you know, we're performing, trying to get the slaves. You know, to there's one. How many do we need? Two. I'm just making two. I'm just wasting some rolls. Oh, that's not good. Take, take one of my inspos. That's not oh, good. Okay. Hey, but I got one of the inspos. <clears throat> yeah, it's better. Okay. better. All righty. So you get Thank the slaves you. to the safe house properly, all down underground into the holding areas um, where they can get, you know, some true rest. Um they, um, yeah, they are safe now, and y'all are holed up in the underground area um, to determine what your next steps are. While we're so, down there, can we can we fish for QB? So that's going to be up to Lori. <laughs> She's going to have to deal with the ramp. You've got a very rambunctious, you know, teenage <sighs> cube now, Lori, that has outgrown is it, his chest, is it, and is it, you. Work have, on that too. He needs the space. Mom, okay, can you're I up put, my Can thrills. I just put him in the bag of holding? Or would he burn? No, oh, you can't that? put him in the bag of holding. Why not? Linus cubes breathe. I, he'll eat, I he'll eat all the stuff that's in there. Oh, yeah, that's true. What's in the bag of holding? Mm. Hang on. I don't we even know if there's like, much in there. We got money. You're in not there. sticking a whole. Money. Stick QB in there. Please do. Please do. No. Okay. She uh, has a pet that, uh, gelatinous cube, folks. Okay, QB. All that okay. money in the party sheet is in a is in Fran. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so you got we're not money. Doing that. Mo- um, so we're gonna hold uh, on here. So this is where we're gonna hold. Okay. What's gonna happen I'll is the yeah y'all have got some discussions. We're going to be off a couple of weeks here uh, with the game here. The ladies, uh, the group is going into downtime to some degree as they've got to plan and letting me know what their next step is. They've got some documents to review to understand what's going on in the area. Uh, they know that they are, you know, dealing with slaver operation, but they also have Jana who has been, don't know actually what happened with Jana. She just disappeared, but where is she? But you also have Mar- this Marquesa to deal with and what's going on. And then while we're, Cause I need some time to prep the next areas of what they want to do with this group. They could take a left turn on a moment's notice. Um, and yes, find our fifth 
female player back to the game. Um, so, uh, but we'll have those discussions in Discord. I'm going to pose some questions to y'all. Y'all have got some talks or if maybe next Saturday without playing, we can have an, uh, you know, a session online that's just hanging out. Y'all can kind of talk about what y'all want to do or you could do it on your own without letting me know, you know, being involved. We'll figure that all out. Um, and then we will make announcements when the group is returning back to the channel here to get the story continuing on. So, does that sound like a plan, ladies? Yeah. Yeah, I'm excited for better. downtime. It's good for me. Yeah, we need a little downtime. Buy yep. some armor. That's true. Well, there you That's go. true. Yep. Uh -huh. And make a bigger box for QB. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, be mom. Like a heart thing, like with wheels. Oh, mom. It's going to get hard. We're going to have All to right, folks. About it. That's where we're going to hold right. off. Uh, we are off tomorrow, like I said. We're back Monday night. Is Seth done with Storm King, or he, we got one more session? He doesn't know. He thinks okay. that he he hopes that the next session will be the last one. Last one. But the group is like their group is like us, where they like to stick around. Yeah. So the other female all group on Monday time. nights <laughs> is driving him crazy. So, um, but they're getting ready to finish up Storm King's Thunder, and then they're going to move into Strixhaven uh, and play in that module and material. Uh, and then, like I said, on our rest of the schedule, we've got all our shows going on uh, and planning as we move into February for the charity stream and then into March, which has got the Gamers for Giving and Gary Khan. So plenty going on, uh, several downtimes uh, uh, happening, but uh, we'll get it all worked out. Uh, thanks, for, oh, thanks for their tier sub. All righty, folks, we're going to call it there. Thank you all for watching. Um, we'll run the outro, and then we'll send over a raid to... Uh, maybe somebody is streaming. We'll find out. But uh, thank you all very much and take care. We'll see you later. Bye. Your squad is ready for you to lead them through with Johnny 7 OMA. You charge. Fire grenade. Bullseye for Johnny 7. Watch out, tank. Fire anti armor shell. Fire anti tank rocket. Johnny Seven's got him on the run. Johnny Seven fires bullets like a rifle. Fires like a Tommy gun. Now it's a cap-firing pistol. You've won with Johnny Seven, the one-man army gun. It's seven guns in one. Let's count them. One is a grenade launcher. Two anti-armor gun. Three anti-tank gun. Four bullet-firing rifle. Five Tommy gun. Six anti-bunker gun. Seven cap-firing pistol. There's no other gun like it. To be sure, look for Johnny Seven, OMA, the one-man army by Topper.